I'm a family man. I'm a family man. Thank you, Guile, for that line. All right, let's get this. <laughs> Go home and celebrate Easter like a family man. Indeed, family man. All right, let's let's get this shindig going. All right, so let's listen, it up. folks at home, how are you doing? I'm your pal Slow Beef, of course, with my met, my good friend Void Burger. Howdy. So you know, howdy you y'all. We have a we have a swear jar going, okay? Which is basically if I skip dialogue that I don't read or I don't pay attention or whatever, you know, then we're gonna add to the swear jar. And then I'll say I'll I'll if you can think of something funnier or more appropriate, like you know, then whatever. But I'll 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 give you a gift sub for each like swear jar yeah. thing there is, you know. But if they, they may think of anything funnier or whatever, that's fine too. <laughs> you wish you were under your adventure. They don't think much of me here. It's like you wish you watch your adventure game again. Game. Today, game. <laughs> Let's break the fourth wall for you, Link. You're clearly a dumb, dumb child. <laughs> right. Now it has been two weeks, to be honest. So yes, um, I want to remind you that we have an appointment at one a.m. or two a.m. somewhere. Do you remember where? Yeah, it's at um, not Romani Ranch. Mm hmm. Okay. Cool, gonna, cool. So you yeah. can fuck around if you want. You have not been in this building that you're right next to. Mm -hmm. And that was basically the two things we wanted to do, if I remember correctly, is go That's in this right. building and keep that appointment at the ranch. Let's see here. Uh, all right. Let's see here. What's wrong with this man? <laughs> I don't know. Is he someone from Ocarina? Yes, he had like a it. he had he he was at the Hylian research lab, uh, and he didn't really help you do much. Uh, maybe he gave you like fifty rupees for something. I don't really remember what he did. But it's that place where you can use the iron boots and see a, a spooky shark at the bottom of the tank. Ooh. Wow, gosh, it's been it's been so long. You gotta fucking replay I Ocarina. I, I I didn't know you were so like at this point so so far off from familiarity I, with Ocarina. That's so I interesting. Didn't, I didn't either, truthfully. I thought I did, but then you mentioned the stuff. I'm like, I have no recollection. Um, oh. did you also watch the Zora eggs hatch? I haven't seen these important eggs haven't arrived yet. Wait, I'm watching them hatch, but those... Oh, I did, get it. I'm, did you it. come to watch them hatch? Well, they're not here. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I understand now. Interesting. So if I get the eggs, I'd probably have to come back on day one, deposit the eggs, you know, and then come back, like, day three, maybe, and then get them to hatch, but they already quit the aquarium. They may die. Didn't the, the pirate Gerudo steal Zora eggs? Am I... Mm-hmm. Hmm. Absolutely. Temperature. They only catch. They're placed in this aquarium water, which I set aside them for long ago. Well, where are this? They're still late. I wonder if having a zero hall. So I wonder too if I have to like grab the water from this aquarium in a jar to carry them back, maybe. But we'll uh, see I don't know. We'll find. We'll find out. I'm curious. If you turn into Zora Link here, does he talk to you different? Because you're Zora. Let's find out together. I forget. What about the yes, eggs? specifically c because you look like Mikau, the guy that's dead. <sighs> That's right, that's right, that's right. Oh, yeah, okay, let's see here, speak. Whoa, he's got a, I've seen that. Is that the windmill clock? But no, it looks, it's a clock though. It's like- That is uh, the, a miniature version of the clock town tower. Yeah, yeah, How cute okay. is it? I wish I could buy it, like IRL. I wonder- I'd never be able to tell the time on it, but <laughs> You just I had an art project I was gonna do. I was gonna try to make a shadow box with World of Horror, and then I totally Ooh. forgot about it. And then, cause I, I, can't, I don't do I don't do crafts usually, but you know, mm -hmm. sometimes you gotta, sometimes you gotta, you know, spread your wings, try a new thing. <laughs> cosplay as Azora, whatever you like. What do you mm, got I'd love to cosplay as Azora. They're cool as hell. They are pretty cool. You're tall. You can pull it off. All right. Oh so. yeah, I think so. I'm not very spelt anymore, though. Thanks uh, two years of quarantine. Seriously, right? <laughs> Serious. <laughs> Your lips to God's ears, right? All right. Uh, so, uh, my hips to God's ears, am I right? <laughs> <laughs> you still got it, Void. Um, cha -cha. Hey, cha -cha. All right, off to off to the ranch, and hopefully, <laughs> oh, to Milk Road, which like after oh, yeah. Silk Road, like takes like an hour. <laughs> yep. <laughs> Trade your crypto rupees for illicit deku seeds <laughs> or whatever. You Ridiculous. got the milk. <laughs> I got the goods. You got the milk. Don't you know using crypto 
rupees makes the moon come faster. It's, it's <laughs> We're terrible. going to the moon. No, wait, the moon is coming to us. <laughs> oh, man, this is the start of actual fan fiction. I'm, but, you know, that's fine. <laughs> um, I forgot the song for Epona. It's, uh, oops, it's, uh, I also forgot how, like, it's, this uh, is Up left, right, up left, right. Yeah, it is. Yeah, yeah, it is. Yeah, it's, go me. You let, you... Link ride, you link ride. No, um, I don't know. Uh, you like roach. Was was is, I? You love roach or something? That's right. Yeah. You I think. Love roach, you love roach. You love roach. <laughs> you love roach. It's That's also cool. like I, I should have known. Like you weren't as familiar with like Ocarina at this point because like a lot of these songs are reoccurring from mm -hmm. Ocarina like uh, Epona song like the song of time and it's like oh shit these are like iconic you know muscle memory and and sound memory things how come he doesn't just know it to be totally fair too I'm, I am like terrible with sound stuff Really, just oh, yeah. any anything in video games like location, directions, control, <laughs> sound. It's you know. Uh, uh, here. Um, so I think you can go in the house and talk to uh talk to the girls. Oh, to I'm not this, really sure though. To get this to get this party started. Here. You still have to wait until the time, but I think she's like, I'm almost ready. Like you're here too early or something. Sam, maybe they're in here. I don't remember. Oh, yeah, I kind of. Oh yeah. Do I need? I don't. I don't. Well, I don't know for sure. Do I need like hearts or life or whatever? You know, are they gonna? You can run around and go collect some. You got time. That's true. I don't, I don't think you need them. I don't think these guys like attack you really. I didn't. Yeah. Oh, don't fuck around with that guy. <laughs> I, know, I know. I'm. I'm afraid. <laughs> uh oh. Good old. You remember old... that at least from Ocarina. Actually, I remember from Link to the Past, and then uh. I did it again in Ocarina, because I'm like, oh no, it does happen again, you know? <laughs> but I don't I don't think it happened on the Game Boy one, probably because it, it couldn't, you know? But mm. yeah. Too resource intensive, these, I don't, these chickens. I don't know much about computers, but... You know what's funny? I, I feel like, too, the, the most... Um, Kind of like far off the beaten path Zeldas are the one that's like the, the ones that are the best remembered. Like Link's Awakening gets a lot of good credit, you know? Oh, yeah, absolutely. I'm like not the most familiar with non 3D Zelda games because my first Zelda game was Ocarina of Time mm -hmm. and my second was Majora and like my third was, uh, I guess, Twilight Wind Waker. Princess? Oh, I think Wind Waker. Was it Wind Waker next? Yeah, I think. Yeah. That, yeah. And then, um, yeah, then then it was Twilight Princess. That's the first yeah. one I never finished, actually, was Twilight Princess. Mm. And then I bought Skyward Sword. I played two minutes of it, and I stopped playing it. It sounds like a video game <laughs> hipster thing, but I just never played uh. it. You know? I, uh, I played... I think I played all of Skyward Sword. It just didn't leave, like, a huge impression on me. Um, and I think I played all of Twilight Pr Princess, but it felt like a slog. And the mm. only thing I remember about it was that fucking excellent capitalist baby... Uh, in Skyward Sword? M Malo? Not Skyward Sword. Twilight Prince. Uh, Twilight Princess? Was that the one with the capitalist baby? Named Malo. Malo? I, I didn't know. play I enough of... I love I that stinking that baby. <laughs> Fucking hilarious. He's just a little man. <laughs> Wait, there's a well, boss baby in Twilight Princess? That's a, there's a boss baby in Twilight Princess, buddy. Oh my god. I that, can't that's believe... a boss baby. I would love it if B Boss Baby actually stole like its whole premise <laughs> from. He was voiced by Alec Baldwin and everything. <laughs> oh, I yeah, heard Skyward Boss Sword has uh, has Groose. The Groose is loose. What was this? I heard th I heard Boss Baby is actually going NFT. That's not even a joke. Oh man, come on, dude. <laughs> yeah, that's I a think... terrible sentence you just said. <laughs> I know it really is, but it's true. It's true. I'm pretty sure. I, I heard, heard Boss Baby is going NFT. It is. <laughs> oh, he's a dick. So yeah, it makes. Let's see here. Yeah, I mean, it's in character, honestly. It, it tracks. That's the problem, really. Yeah, you know? yeah, yeah. It's like honestly the best use case of wit. That's um, Link. You're walking on. You can't walk on that. I'm walking on you, chimneys. You can't walk on that. Whoops. So I believe this is just like a sniping spot if you don't want to do the horseback riding stuff, but you know that there's like a bunch of trees in your way visually there. Yeah. I personally haven't really done it this way or I've had di more difficulty doing it this way than just doing it on Epona. But, you know, it's up to you, I guess. I, um, I... And also like the 
other side of the barn, you can't see too good either because the barn is in the way. That's, yeah, gotcha. So it's a little like, it might look viable, but uh, it's not really. Mm -hmm. So I don't think there's any uh, HP in, in these. You know what? Here's what you do. Uh, fly again to Milk Road. Mm -hmm. There's a ferry next to that, um, next to the owl statue. What time does this all go down? Like 2 a.m. or like something? Like 2 a.m. Yeah, you got, got time. time. Yeah. You, you could also even speed up time and be back here with plenty of time. You're probably right. Uh, in fact, you are right. Not even probably. So let's see. <laughs> um, what, how does it go? Rad rad? No. Yeah, rad rad. To speed up time? No. Yes. No, no, no. Other way around. Dardar. Dardar? <laughs> I don't know. It's the one that sounds sad. That's right. Whoa, 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 whoa. I will return the flow of time to normal. Oh. Sounds sad. Link looks like really dizzy. He probably gets really like nauseous from this time travel. I went to so over the weekend I was visiting a, f a friend of mine in Wisconsin mm. with uh, other internet friends of mine, such as Tomato Grandpa, and it was so hey. nice. It was so nice to hang out with real people. <laughs> it was emotional. Nice. Oh, I hugged them so much. So many Aww. times. I've been hugging a, uh, someone who is a whole, full head shorter than me for too long. I miss <laughs> hugging people my size. <laughs> but um, we went to uh, this friend of a friend's workplace, which was uh, Epic, not the games. It's people that make like medical technology software. So uh, they have a fucking dumbass uh, campus with dumbass amounts of buildings and all these buildings are dumbass themed it was fucked up stupid um and because all these buildings are themed like there's a harry potter offshoot one there's like a lord of the ringsy area there's like all this stupid different themes and bullshit mm -hmm. and a lot of that comes with a bunch of like incredibly eyesore carpeting that i was just literally like going from different carpet to different carpet in different buildings i was like actually feeling like really disoriented <laughs> <laughs> like it felt it felt like it felt exactly like how like when you get brand new glasses how you t it takes like two days to really get used to the glasses and you feel kind of cross-eyed and like dizzy but not mm -hmm. really it felt like that and i was like fucking woof i feel hungover or something <laughs> this is awful feeling i what do you go i'm supposed to wear glasses and i don't um because my brother and sister both told me which is probably not smart of them um they're like 13 to 15 years older than i am but like they told me like oh yeah i had to wear glasses too but now i wore them too much and now i need them so when i was younger i was like i better not wear these or i'm gonna need them you know <laughs> Yeah, but it, it's kind of true. Pull your, pull your eyeballs up by your bootstraps here. <laughs> it really was, like, something weird like that. And uh, it was funny because, like, um, you know, because my daughter wears glasses, so she's like, how come you don't oh, wear glasses? Oh, they're so cute. They're so they cute on her. She does really, yeah. She, she rocks you don't even need this shit right now. You should save these patches for when you need to re-ammo re yourself. You know, you're right. Up, you on. could respawn him by leaving the ranch and coming That's back, us. though. Yeah, but you, yep. I don't th think you can leave the ranch when the shit's going down. Right. So. But I still got a little time, right? You got a little bit. You got one hour. So leave, come back. <laughs> Maybe I should slow down time again. Oh, my God. All right. Um, you, could, you could, and you probably might want to, because then the the uh, enemies will be going away slower. It'll be easier to hit. That isn't how that works, says Shadowhog. Well, you're right, actually, it's not. Um, I think it's more just like I was, I'm like a little bit farsighted and have a little bit of astigmatism, so I don't like need him, need him, but it was like, you, you know, you want to yeah. slow down with time, you should probably oh, do it you're right, right about right. now, right about now. So I think this happens at two, it might be like 2.30 or something. Let me That's check. That's fine. Uh, yeah, it's um, two. I can't think of like a good, like, all right, rad rad resets everything. Like reset a day, reset a day, you know. And then like, what does R R A R R A A D D do when you double it up? That's Doubling just it up. oh, that like just goes to the next like day, right? Like that's just like mm -hmm. go to the night or whatever. Yeah. Yeah. No, no mnemonic coming Damn. out. Of that That'd be incredible. Just double double speed, like double speed. R R A A D D. Yeah. Double skips some head some, I think. Right. Okay, that's fair. Okay. Um, I'm I'm worried about how this is gonna go, but I I I got faith. I got faith. Just you know, aim true, and make make nice uh, circular 
like motions around. Like it's nice to have a like route that you know that you don't really deviate too much from, and always look at your map because they will appear on your map. Got it. Look at that ridiculous map too. It looks like a very confused like cat, maybe you know. <laughs> like, oh, like something's on my nose. I don't understand <laughs> this. You know. Mm -hmm. My mom has a cat that she really loves, and uh, she likes. She like I talk to it, and so she like lives along with this cat now, and like. Uh, but apparently a big fly got in her house and the cat's like really freaked. Oh, hey. There she is. There she is. There she is. Get off, get off, get off. Get off. Wait, why are we talking to you? I forgot, but whatever. Hey, 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 hey. Talk. Do I have to talk to her out here or? Z target. There you go. It's almost time. Grasshopper. Oh, that's right. She called me grasshopper. Yep. Look at that. Yeah, so she's going to be in the barn, I believe. Crates of them near the house? Okay. No, oh, that's a and crate. it's yeah. just and it's just gonna like start when it when it is time. <sighs> this scared the, the poop out of me when I was little. I was like, this is stressful. This mm -hmm. is kinda spooky. I'm I was nervous. a nervous child. <laughs> Lizzie says, I'm nervous as though I'm the one playing, which is interesting. So I guess <laughs> I'm thinking when the sun touches the bottom, maybe. Maybe. Dun, 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 dun. You'll know there'll oh, be a cutscene. Oh, shit. Yeah. Two, three, four, five, six. Oh, dear. oh my gosh, the map. Oh, yeah. my gosh. Okay. Yep. So just just hit those guys. All right. This dog is of no help. Nice, good one. And they do respawn. So there's going to be ones that are closer to the barn that have respawn points a little closer to it. And they're a little more concerning than the ones that are very far away. Mm -hmm. But yeah. you don't want them to like, you know, sneak up too much. But they're moving nice and slow. So just take your time, see thorough. And uh, yeah, the barn is the little second building on the map. Oh, that was almost a good shot. Thank you. <laughs> that was almost that was almost sarcastic sounding. Like, that was almost <laughs> a good shot. But... That was almost a good shot. I'm sorry. Almost, that did sound but... sarcastic. <laughs> <laughs> that was almost a successful arrow. Uh-oh. There you go. There you go. No problem. Whoa. Hey. All right. Nice that shot. Was, that was a that nice was, shot. Right that, was like a no, that was like a no-scope kind of deal. That's what the kids <laughs> call it, right? Yeah. Here we go. The kids. Yeah. All right. Up arrow. Shoot. Go, go, go. Nice, nice, nice. You're doing pretty good. Just uh, stay the course. And they always drop arrows when they die, it looks like. So you can always refill your arrows by just running over those. I think they're respawning faster because that guy is already back. No, Ooh. it's because you killed him very close to his spawn point to begin with. Oh. Yeah, they're not like really on a timer. They're on like a, like, they're like just... kind of? Oh dear, wait. They're, on, they're all on very discreet paths. So if you kill them right where they spawn, they're going to come back immediately. So don't worry too much about that guy. He's got he's got some. Oh, I see what you're go. saying. Got it. Yeah. yeah. I got it. Got it. Okay. So. <laughs> Jeez. I mean, it didn't do. Look at all these all these beautiful arrows. So in case you didn't know, these uh, aliens are basically based off of the Flatwoods monster. They look almost exactly like them. Different texture, I'm guessing. Like they just kind of recolored it and then call it a call it a <laughs> call it a monster. Mhm. Mm they just want a specific uh, to evoke a specific alien, I guess. Hmm. Hmm. Please pick up these arrows are dropping. I'm trying, I'm trying. <laughs> You're I'm like, bothering me. The problem is, too, I'm honestly, like, kind of nervous about, like, letting one get too close or something, you know? Oh, but yeah. Oh, no, absolutely. It's like, this is like... We're doing it, good. I hope so. This is like You're a time good. management stress kind of deal, too. You know what I mean? It's like, if you don't do this right, you know, you're going to have to redo it, and then... Mm -hmm, absolutely, it's brutal. Yeah. But no, you're doing great. They're going slow. Nice yeah. shot. Thank you. And they go slow too because of uh, the time thing. Like yes. the slow down time. So if you awesome. wanted to speed this up and also them, you could do this at normal speed. But I figure, hey, let's have a leisurely alien hunt. 
I'll let the Dark Souls community laugh at me for doing it the cheap way or whatever. You know, it's fine. It's fine. But no, you're doing great. You're doing great. We'll we'll summon for or and snow or whatever. The... I've never learned how to pronounce that guy's name. I Smog. I always like Smow, but it is I think Smog. it's Smow. Someone told me. Smuff. You know, how would you know? They don't say it. You know. No. But, um... It's not like the loathsome dung eater. <laughs> I do like, um, if, well, I don't know how you feel about boss spoilers in the Souls games. You know? eh. So I feel like once it's all about uh, how an individual handles the guy. Gotcha. But like... Whatever they are. Dark Souls 2 has you fight just Ornstein, and it's like easier, obviously, you know, but it's like, it feels so good because you'll like kind of wreck him, and it's like, he's usually so hard. It's like, Where's your this. friend, little man? <laughs> yeah. Like, look who's grown. Look who's grown, you know? <laughs> Not look so who's... tough when you don't have your buddy, huh? <laughs> you can't bully me anymore, Ornstein! You're nothing! <laughs> I'm not a dragon! You can't slay shit! Anyway, uh. <laughs> Careful who you make fun of in high school. <laughs> Look at you now! <laughs> you know it! Oh god. <laughs> Jesus. Sorry. That's my That that unlocks the memory. No, um. <laughs> here. Okay. Uh oh, oh, I have to just do this till like 6 a.m. or whatever is the idea. Uh-huh, yeah, till the sun uh, rises. Got it. Be up till uh I believe 6 a.m. Check. Yeah, 6 a.m. So yeah, stay frosty. Halfway there. Oh! White people love this song when it's played at weddings. It's a big Jersey thing. I always thought it was a Jersey thing. I didn't it, know like, I mean, everybody. Mm, I mean, it's like a Jersey New York thing, definitely, but I don't know. I feel like it's also just like a white people love this song thing. Mm -hmm. I saw like a TikTok that was some guy that was like songs that white people lose their fucking shit over at weddings and like the first song was living it on prayer and i was like yeah yeah it's like a religious fucking song <laughs> like people all get up they start fucking holding their hands up praising what do you call it you know what's triumph the insult comic dog was actually on stage with bon jovi bon jovi and he sang its version, his version of it. You Living know. on the prayer. Yeah, but it was. <laughs> For me uh, to <laughs> look at you. It, I, look at you. I won't do the voice. I'm so funny. <laughs> <laughs> it's the same joke, yeah. But you know, it's uh. <laughs> it was look at you guys. Have you no shame? You give poop a bad name, which is. Which, oh, it's well, shot from the heart, is what that, I'm thinking. Yeah, that's, that's you give love a bad name. That's you know that's kind of the same song in a way. It's so oh. much the same song. Oh my god. <laughs> I never noticed. It is so close to the goddamn same. Wait, how did I not get those arrows? Oh, hey, we did it. Hey! 5 a.m. Wow, yeah, mm -hmm. it's earlier than I thought. Oh my Hooray. god. Submit! Hell oh, yeah, fucking yeah. We did it. We won. The cows are giving thanks to Ramani's thanks. If, if you fail, there's a cutscene where, like, not I, if I'm not fucking mistaken, or maybe I had a dream about this once. It's a whole bottle, oh my god, of delicious moo. Wow, plus it's um, nice. But um, there's a, there's a cutscene where like they show the cows getting abducted and also Romani herself gets abducted and that's why on day three, she's like nowhere to be found around the ranch. Oh wow. The, her older sister Kremia is just like, oh my god, she was right. Why didn't I listen? And she's like all alone on the ranch because her sister got fucking abducted by aliens. <laughs> creepy. It's a, it is, it's a creepy cutscene, apparently. So, all right. So listen, here's the deal. My theory. Oh, it's only the first mm -hmm. day, actually. Well, almost. Oh yeah. I guess right. Yeah, but got anyway. tons of farting around time. Cool. Wait, how is it 5 a.m. the first day if? The... No, it's 5 a.m. the second day. Why does it say first on the thing? Because uh, days roll around at 6 a.m. All right, then. Oh, okay, yeah. Like, tw yeah, season like one of the seasons of 24 did that. Yeah, I understand. Okay, cool. Um, <laughs> also, uh, you know, real life kind of does that a little bit at midnight. Of, well, <laughs> midnight, yeah. I'm just saying. Season 3, I think, started at 6. Uh. I forget. <laughs> <laughs> Season three was where it started to go bad, but anyway, whatever. Um, yeah, just like an Animal Crossing, that's right, my Spiky Mike in the chat. Creepy ghosts wear a cape. I felt like I was 
gonna see if I could cat. I couldn't. All right, I couldn't get into the aquarium, so my carry the Zora egg in the bottle theory is not great, right? Why? Well, because you couldn't get. Don't you need to be in the water to actually use the um thingamabob the bottle? I think I could try it. I mean, it doesn't hurt. So. Well, I mean, you don't have an egg yet, so. Right, What's but. To say. Uh, yeah. Yeah, that's right. And she can't speak because she's upset because the band because what's his face is yeah is well, I can't think of his name but <laughs> Mikal well Mikau. she she's upset because her eggs got stolen by pirates that she doesn't right. even she doesn't even know her boyfriend's dead which is really fucked up when you think about it I am wondering though if I should try to rescue the eggs now or reset to day one and do it then mm -hmm, so I have time to mm -hmm. watch them hatch yeah. And those mm -hmm. those sound like you're yes you should do those that kind of mm -hmm's. so let's well, just do that well sure I'm just trying to think of like is there other stuff we could do on this yeah, loop well, that yeah. is helpful to do especially because um because we did the UFO thing there might be some stuff we might want to do relatedly to that um uh. let me let me look it up I think there might be something we want to do actually to get a certain mask that you can only do because you did the UFO thing on the first mm -hmm. day. Okay. And I think it has to do with the Gorman brothers. If cow is protected. Okay. Oh, yeah, those jerks. I forgot about them. Gorman has a frightful mm. face. Uh, it looks like there's something with Gorman around, like, nighttime to uh, second day, you know? Mm hmm Postman something. Let me see if I'm right about this. Does a bow mean I got a thing like that's not necessarily a mask? Like that's com yeah, it is because there's yeah, like it, it's like complete right. kind of yeah. like you got a present from them for doing something for them. Um. Oh, and didn't I save the woman? So we're gonna see what the guy has for sale on the final day. I know we were talking about doing uh, that. you yeah, you were talking about, it, but you didn't because that happens at one a.m. and we were already at the room waiting around yeah, during that right, point, right, so we didn't right. do that. We All did right. that some other loop, though. Um, so, yeah, if Link helps Romani defend the cows from the ghosts on the night of the first day, there's another thing you can do around the ranch. So you might want to talk to the girls now that it's daytime. Don't look up. Don't look up. The girls. Mm -hmm. Kremia still has something. Mm -hmm. Thanks mm -hmm. for reading the chat. Uh, oh, sorry. I mean, and I thanks, for, thanks for spoiling it, chat. <laughs> Actually, wait, I will ask chat, did the picture, does the picture look okay? I feel like the map seems a little squished suddenly, and I couldn't, I couldn't tell you why that would be, but it still look, it looks the same on my OBS, so maybe I'm just seeing things. Okay, whatever. No time to me. All right, then. I'll hide chat now. Bye-bye. <laughs> oh. Yes, it was on the notebook, but he didn't notice it, so it's up to him to notice that. Actually, and so, I... And it's huh? up to me oh. to guide him as the person... Who actually knows a decent amount of stuff? So like, if I'm just wrong, I'll I'll like be unsure of something. I'll like I'll, ask the chat and read the chat. But like, yeah. But, <laughs> but let me let me prove to you. I think I did notice this, which is okay. that Kremia's thing starts pretty soon. I didn't see exactly what time. There were three little boxes, and whatever the other person who's calling me Grasshopper, whose name I'm blanking on, it Romani. starts later in the day. Ramon, Romani, mm -hmm. yeah. Because if I go down here, Kremia's starts. Oh, okay, wait. No, wait. Yeah, I am wrong. That's so, what was I thinking of then? Somebody else had, like, a thing that starts soon? Was it the postman? Well, I look, just... Kremia's thing, she does have a thing in the middle of day day two. Yeah, I guess I must be mixing it up. I thought there was... No, like, oh, I'm thinking of... what you I'm... saw. Yeah, think. I'm thinking of the three boxes here. I mixed it up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, yeah, I'm just... Okay, got it, got it, got it. Okay, Kremia's thing starts, like, midway through the day. So, I don't know if there's anything I can do right at this minute, but listen, you like Roach, you like riding... Oh, okay. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I feel like riding you like riding probably makes That's it's probably better list. than than having a weird witcher association. <laughs> there you go. You like riding parentheses a horse. <laughs> Implied a horse. <laughs> and then we can also randomly to bet on dog racing while we're waiting. <laughs> God damn it. <laughs> but there's a trick. I, I need a mask that lets me talk to dogs. Is the is the is the secret? I bet. But that said, I don't have it. So, <laughs> Let's see here. 
<laughs> I don't know if that's true or not, but whatever. It's like they said, like, there's like some way of telling. But, okay. Mm -hmm. Are you. Huh? Oh, that's Kremia. Oh, my. Hello. Take our milk to clock down, too. Why is yeah. she talking in third person? <laughs> she fucking Elmo. <laughs> yes, sister. I'm going by wagon into town. Would you like a ride? I'll be leaving about six o'clock so you can join me. Mm hmm. All right. Well, How come you... it didn't, like, give you a do 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 do? You made an appointment. <laughs> <laughs> like, I didn't, Link didn't pencil it in. It's like, I don't, I don't have know. a pen. I'll, just, I'll remember it. It's a, it's a soft obligation, I guess. Right. <laughs> um, is there other stuff we should do while we're waiting? Because we could, we could think. check out Postman. He's got a yeah, thing going sure. on. Yeah, right sure. He's now. got a whole bunch of. You can stalk him for a while. I haven't really figured out the postman at all. Mm hmm. You know what I mean? Like, he's he's been around. I know I have things with him, but, like, I can't figure out what he would want or what to do with him. I know that one jerk wants that mask and he won't talk to me. The frog mask. The, or, no, the fox mask. The Kitsune mask or whatever. But I hope it's called the Kitsune mask and I'm not just being a total, like, like <laughs> anime dirt, jerk. Goddamn and, weeaboo. Mm hmm. It's actually called the Keaton Mask. Oh. Is that because of Zelda or Japan? Eh, well, it was called the Keaton Mask in Ocarina of Time. Because it was one of the few masks that showed up in uh, the OG for oh. a mask quest. Did I get the third <laughs> heart piece like by getting the Zora version of this guy? You know what I mean? I don't like, remember. I, I don't, I don't remember. <laughs> but, you know... I'll just say logic will dictate that there's going to be another link in that chain that you can't access yet, so you have to do it all okay. over again anyway because there's a, there's fourth, a whole other yeah. area we haven't been to yet. That's <laughs> right. I keep forgetting. I was thinking because it's... Yeah, you're right. I don't... I don't know what the fourth mask could be, though. You know, like what else we could transform into. Mm -hmm. But um, that having been said, uh, I'm looking for a postman. Did, they, did I do these jerks already? These jugglers? Do they have a thing? Here? Chad, if you... If you Post I'm not looking. And, and say that I'm gonna I'm gonna fucking snooze you, man. Don't yeah, I'm not looking at chat. I'm gonna snooze you if you correct him on that. Be like, actually, you can you, you can just hit ban. I don't care. <laughs> true these people. No, I have the power, chat. Do not tempt my power. There's there's, there's a sword there for a reason, folks. It's, <laughs> <laughs> something something gold uh i like that two people in a row was like actually i wasn't listening which is uh really great that you have such great retention on your screens <laughs> 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 two people uh, immediately was like actually i was not <laughs> <laughs> that is the only reason i did not correct you i was not listening <laughs> <laughs> I'm fine with the I'm fine with the I'm doing something else kind of audience, you know. It's just funny to immediately post and be like, no, no, I'm not listening. And the no, <laughs> <laughs> something going on. Oh, there's a stream in this tab. Oh, <laughs> starts at 6 p.m. on the dot. What is? Oh, you know what? I never did. I never did the thing as like all the masks, the um treasure chest thing. Ah, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. All I right, all right. Do that. We have 112 rupees to kill. It's raining, just like in real kill. life. Kill these rupees. You know it's killing me, by the way? So, allegedly, there's a nor'easter going on, uh -huh. which seems fine to me. I, I, like, I, like, why is it even called that? Is it northeastern, but with these terrible little, like, apostrophes for some regional thing? Or is it happening? Yeah, or I, what? I don't really know. I, I think it's either. just easier to say instead of northeaster. I think I it's guess. just, like, it got slurred over time and... Meteorologists were just like, eh, let's just call it this. It sounds cooler. <laughs> I was really drunk when I wrote it down, and now they tease me about it, you know. <laughs> but, okay, honey and dark. No, this is the bomb. Wait, do no, I'm the second day anyway. I don't think I don't think they have a three-day thing, right? Like the... Uh, yeah, I don't remember, but... Uh, yeah. mm, I don't whatever. think they're in the notebook. They might be in the notebook. I don't know. Well, the Deku scrub guy isn't in the notebook, right? The one you can do three days on for the heart piece, but... Mm. Uh, what's your deal? Oh, yeah, I got you. Yeah, I'm still missing people. Yeah, it's kind of weird that like not everybody who has like a quest is in is represented in the quest log. Right. I feel like like for example the mm -hmm. Deku guy. Right. right. The bombers don't want to help him for whatever reason. <laughs> They're racist. Everyone's racist against the Deku's. Terrible. Terrible. 
terrible. Terrible world here in Termina. <laughs> you'd think you'd think the giant moon would bring everyone together, but <laughs> just like Watchmen. <laughs> just like COVID, really. <laughs> oh you know, yeah, yeah, just like that. <laughs> yeah. Oh man. That's it, right? In real life, now Alan Moore is like, wow, that wouldn't have worked. That was a terrible idea. You know? <laughs> I was but, wrong. <laughs> yeah. Also, I'm weird. But um, let's see here. <laughs> uh, let's see. What is this? What is this? Is is the treasure chest thing on the other side? I thought it was East Block Town. It's the building that looks like a big treasure chest, I believe. That's right. It is, isn't it? <laughs> hmm. is, and it's you. That's this building, huh? All right, then. <laughs> Well, to be fair, treasure chests don't usually have doors in them. But, Bless right. your heart. Right. <laughs> yes, I would like to... Oh, handsome, huh? Hmm. Lady. Five rupees, eh? Have you seen The Shape of Water? Are you interested? <laughs> <laughs> I haven't seen The Shape of Water. It's about, a fish, guy. It's about yeah. a fish guy with a nice ass. Oh, brother. Is that Del Toro? <laughs> I forget. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Gotcha. I never saw him the same after Death Stranding, because there's like, <laughs> there's like this. I creepy, get it. But there's like this weird, creepy scene where like he's in the shower with Sam, you know? He's like, oh yeah, up. he's like fully dressed and he's like getting all wet and stuff like that, and be like, we have to talk in secret. Yeah, and it's like, wait, oh wait, look at this. Oh yeah, this valid. Way you can easier. Do this. Yeah. It's, do you normally get an, an an overhead view if you hold down Z for Z targeting? For this. Yeah, okay, gotcha. I didn't realize yeah. Okay. Yeah, this is way... Uh, this is, I don't know, it's easier for me to conceptualize <laughs> if I'm running out of... Except you're going sideways, yeah, so... Yeah, right. Well, there's that <laughs> part of it. I didn't say it's perfect strategy. But she's giving me the, the handsome, the handsome <laughs> fish man discount, so, you know, it's fine. Handsome fish count. Handsome <laughs> fish count, exactly. Here we go. Come on now. What are you playing lately? You have anything you want to plug? Oh, uh, what am stuff? I playing lately? Oh, 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 oh. oh no. Oh, I never Go, going and hanging out with real people on the weekend put a damper nice. on you know playing video games. Me too, I but forgot me... all about. That's how that works. Um, me too, but also Patrick's Parabox. Oh yeah, you like yeah, it, huh? I love. I finished it. And uh, oh shit! I'm going 100 percent now because I really like Whoa. it a lot. Oh, you smart. I'm something. I'm too, I'm I'm, too dumb. Nah, I just try all the combinations till something works. Oh, uh, you're just stubborn. I'm just yeah, exactly. It's the same. I think it's the same thing, honestly. That's my that's my theory about the and the end dimensional oopsness of <laughs> of smartness. <laughs> no, it's true though, right? Because like no, it, no, yeah, yeah. it's it's <laughs> like. Like you Smart, have this smartness is is eighty percent stubbornness. <laughs> yeah, no, I I mean the the n dimensional part of it. Too. It's like what you wouldn't have a one dimensional thing. You wouldn't have this like super complex electrical system in your f fucking skull that's all like electrochemical and shit. And it's just like one line. You know, either it's good or bad, <laughs> and that's that. That's all we do. You know. Some some people operate on that though. <laughs> But that's I know, but it makes no. I, I worked. You know. I worked in an escape room. I saw people doing the same thing over and over again, expecting a different result, and I was like, "Oh, buddies." Mm -hmm. And but, they and then they started prying things off the walls, and I was like, "Y'all, it's nailed to the walls for a reason." And that that person could probably tell you everything there is to know about crypto. You know what? Like, <laughs> or you know. football, or like right. something that's like a very niche interest that they have encyclopedic knowledge of. My wife. Common sense. Hoofa doofa. <laughs> You know what's funny though? My wife like doesn't like. She's like, she's like. I like told her like, you know, you're allowed to be nerdy about certain things in the world, like football, you know. Mm -hmm. But like, it, and she's and I was like, can you imagine though? People talked about like Pokemon the way you talk about football, you know, just like Gen three was the best one. After that, I don't know. You know what I mean? Like, I don't know what they did to Pikachu, but he had like. <laughs> So much he had a really, he had a really good season, 1998. Yeah, <laughs> it wasn't the same after that. Exactly. Yeah, yeah. Everything went to went to hell once once they yeah, like, like my, went to my, the my father-in-law. Uh, he, you know, I'm not married, but I call him that anyway. Yeah, yeah. Um, nobody freak out about that. Um, he has like the most encyclopedic knowledge of football, college football, mm -hmm. I've ever seen in my life. Statistics. He know you can name a year and a and a 
and mm -hmm. a, two teams, and he knows the end score of that, no matter what game it is. And it's like, dude, is this necessary? Like, <laughs> I know it's like, and I should not even judge, you know? <laughs> No, for sure, I'm, yeah, but... I'm a fucking dweeb about other stuff, but it's like, man, even I don't have that kind of complete <laughs> acknowledged. It's amazing. Oh, oh, it's, how, it's how to get 20 that's, rupees. That's actually, you know what? That counts, right? But that, that counts. Count. That's the yeah. swear jar right there. That's a swear jar, yeah. I'll get. I'll take yeah. it. I'll take okay. it. Okay. That was me jamming on the buttons. Not, I mean, to be fair, we were also talking, but whatever. Yeah, you yeah, know, yeah. That's but... Life. That's... <laughs> you, you call it. Um... Uh, no, yeah, but like, but yeah, but, um, it, it, it's just, it's totally, it's totally like that. This is different. Mm, it changes a little, I think. I was, I thought, it, yeah, because I was doing it and I'm like, this isn't the same maze, is it? And then I'm thinking, like, am I, like, not paying attention or something? Like, what's going on? But it is different. <laughs> well, it's a mix of it's I not say. the same maze and also gotcha. attention is hard. Yeah. When you're talking about neuroplasticity and everything, you know. No, ah, I just who, who's got it. who's got that in this day and age? Neuroplasticity, <laughs> not me. <laughs> Lost that about twenty vodka bottles ago. <laughs> oh, brother. No, but like I I thought like weren't like trying to teach myself Japanese because you you do that too, right? You like went yeah. on that journey because like I thought well, it was very. I, yeah. I, I dipped my toes in that journey and then went. I'm busy. <laughs> no, you can't though. I learned too because. <laughs> <laughs> no, I, I did Wani Kani to level 60, right? Oh, I'm, my God. I got all the way there, and then, like, Shit. a month later, I forgot, like, all of it. It's oh, like... Oh, no. Gee. Oh! Did you do it again, buddy? Mm-hmm. Oh, hunt. <laughs> Two, fine. <laughs> no, so the, um, no, it's like, but yeah, like, it's because, like, I never knew this really until I was reading more about it, but it's like, language is, like, more like a muscle memory thing than, like, the memorization, you know what I mean? It's like just a totally different mental skill set, like mm -mm. than like math and all that stuff. Because I think like, it's a lot also of like yeah, it's so applied. Like you have to use it. You oh, have yeah. to like use it in different situations. Mm -hmm. Like that's the real practice. Is like it feels like you have to do it in like in context, like in a classroom with people actually talking, or just like immersing yourself like in the actual fucking place that speaks the language. It's like, oh man, this is like a whole level mm -hmm. of commitment that I can't commit to. <laughs> and yeah. I'm not smart enough to do without that kind of format. Like I do like Wani Kani a lot because I feel like, you know, I need, I lack discipline and mm -hmm. I like a test. Like yeah. I like being tested on stuff and Dang, being yeah. told like you did a good job. But like Wani Kani just feels like God, it doesn't end. It just doesn't fucking it doesn't. end. And it piles up if you let it go. And it piles up so bad. Oh my god, I don't even look at my fucking turtles right now. Um, <laughs> so I'm looking this up. How do you get? Uh, da -da 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 -da. how do you get the piece of heart? Uh, as a Deku costs this. The prize is Deku nuts. As a Zora, it costs five. The prize is twenty rupees. As a Goron, it costs thirty rupees. And the prize is a piece of heart. As a Goron. I see. Or. Or 50 rupees if Link has already run the piece of heart during a previous time loop. So you want to be a Goron to do this. Hey, yep. put on the bunny ears. You can go faster. Thanks for the raid, Katie Bunny. Hello. Hey, thanks, Katie Bunny. I'm not reading chat because, you know, I can't trust them. You get the idea. You, know, a, you get the drill. A first time playthrough. Oh. You know, I feel bad Speed for. Demon. I feel like uh, I feel bad for um, Ty Tuesday because he uh, was trying a, 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 a stream of Ghost Trick blind, and then like apparently people oh. just wouldn't, wouldn't stop talking about like things in it, oh. so he had to stop playing it. Which I'm like, that fucking sucks. I know. I think people just can't it. contain themselves, man. I know. And they think they're just being like excitable, but it's really just absolutely either spoilery or just obnoxious where it's just like teehee i know something you don't know i can't wait until he gets to you know the part it's I like know. shut the fuck up i hate yeah and that's absolutely the insufferable like learn the tiniest amount of restraint i'm sorry i'm going on a it's not about you if you're mad at me because i think i'm talking about you i'm not talking about you i'm talking about that other guy over there don't worry you're great you're, um, you're awesome you're free of sin uh but yeah like jesus christ like <laughs> Oh, that's the where, no, where, yeah, where's I... the where's the enjoyment in like spoiling stuff and like lording it over somebody <laughs> lording it over is the the key mm. operative yeah you should change the name of swear jar to something more descriptive like skip dialogue 
swear jar or something. An attention jar. <laughs> distraction jar or an attention jar? I feel like an attention jar. An I'm, attention jar. Yeah, because I'm also using... Or but, button mash jar. <laughs> button mash jar. Oops, okay. Right. Aren't you a fit fellow? <laughs> <laughs> she, she just flirts with everyone that comes here. That's fine. You know, hey. You know... I don't. I, th I think I, a lot of uh, a lot of people think they're helping, of course, you know. Yeah. But it's like that's not helpful. <laughs> you think you're helping, but some of it, I think, too, is like the kind of camaraderie you have when you're like watching something with somebody, like, and it's kind of like, you know, oh, like because a big one that I that uh, not bugs me, I'd say, but like the one that I kind of roll my eyes at a little, especially with like Elden Ring and things, is when people go, "Here we go," when like nothing apparent's happening, because then you know. <laughs> Something yeah. big is gonna happen, you know. Well, something I like about Elden Ring is that you can spoil it for yourself by reading the little messages people have left. It's just like, uh oh, oh, I can tell that some shit's gonna happen. But if you don't want to read it, then you don't have to read it. So but it's I... like the chat; you have to like interact with that. That's part of your job as a streamer. So it's like, man, it's just mm -hmm. like it's a no-win situation sometimes. Oh yeah, I, I mean, I resigned. Whatever. I but you know what I like about reading the messages in Elden Ring is I feel like I figured out a puzzle, even though it's explicitly someone else trying to tell me. You know, because yeah. <laughs> like, part of the puzzle is interpreting what the fuck they mean. <laughs> right. Or they'll be like, "Watch out left," and then I'll block to my left. And I'll be like, "I did that." In reality, no. Someone, you <laughs> I'm know. so smart. I did that. <laughs> I know. It's like it's great. But yeah, like part of like part of how like the reason that those are great and don't feel like spoilers. I think is because there is some part of your brain that has to figure out what the fuck that person's saying a little bit mm -hmm. and that makes it feel like you came to a aha moment and right. you weren't completely led there by the hand. Um, but yeah, a lot of people are just impatient. Um, mm -hmm. They want to be helpful or seem like they're smart because it feels good to, to feel smart, mm -hmm. obviously. So right. like, I, I get the psychology, but it's like as someone who was like an escape room game master forever for three years or whatever it's like hey you can't just blurt out like hey the code you this <laughs> look over here over no behind you okay warmer warmer cooler cooler warmer 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 <laughs> like i did have to play warmer cooler with some incredibly hopeless teams before mm -hmm. <laughs> and that was always like man we're at this fucking junction that sucks <laughs> but even playing warmer cooler was more rewarding for them than if I just said, like, it's in the microwave. <laughs> There's a key in the microwave. Go get it. <laughs> Spoiler. Um, <laughs> no, uh, let me see. Um, I'm trying to think of where this, like, thing is. The, um, the 200 rupees around here, I think, right? Oh, yep. You got My one right here. I already got it, which I, looks like I did. <laughs> the other one is, uh, behind that bomber kid in the, uh, on the left-hand side of the, uh, the tunnel. Uh, up here? Oh, go, yeah. There. Up here and to the right. Not in the tunnel, though. Yeah, in the tunnel, yeah. Oh, in the tunnel, right. Okay. Yeah, the, the one that you blow up with the bomb mask. Uh, alright. 31524, I think. Wait, yeah, let me, oh, okay. You want to not a bunny mask, too. <laughs> She's like, whoa, cool hat! <laughs> <laughs> Can't let you whoa. see, but I'm not even gonna tell you why. Four, two, one, five, two, four, or four, two. It's one of those. Oh, that was it. Nice. Okay. Hey! Hey, finally. Finally, this guy! That, that might cool count as a, as a negative one for the engine jar. <laughs> That's up to you. <laughs> I'll take it if you want. Um, oh, I'll, I'll, I'll allow it. <laughs> right, that's fine. We'll leave it. We'll leave it. That's, I'm also, I'm doing it also to kind of try to combat my own inattention and things. Because <laughs> I think, I, I do think like being distracted and not particularly focused on the game is what leads to some stuff that's like, I can't remember where the heck the thing is or what have you. Absolutely, you know? but, yeah. So it's like, it's training. This is like the Rocky montage, you know? <laughs> Which, by the way, there's a guy on TikTok who, like, made uh, an Elden Ring build that looks like Rocky Balboa. Because oh, my God. That's there's so hilarious. There's these gloves that are, like, the jars, you know? So, like, he oh. puts some, like, boxing gloves, you know? And wow, it's, spoilers it's for the jar boxing gloves. <laughs> <laughs> well, there, I read it in a message, too. So, you know. It's, it's also, um, like, there's so many things in Elden Ring. I feel like even if you spoil one of it, there, there's so many other things to distract you along the way that it's not even going to, you're not going to retain that spoiler very yeah. well. 
The same thing happened to me with like so the way the reason I got into JoJo's Bizarre Adventure, for example, mm. was because Mario, Tomato Grandpa, we were at House on the Rock in Wisconsin. Not this trip, but forever ago, mm. like six, seven years ago. Um, and we were eating ice cream in the middle of the weirdest place in fucking America. And he starts mm. talking about JoJo's Bizarre Adventure and saying we need to we need to watch this thing. We're like, what? Okay, like I'm about. And he's like, I'm not gonna tell you what it's about, but I will tell you exactly what. And he <laughs> proceeds to explain in great detail uh, the final boss fight of the of um, Diamond is Unbreakable. Because so much weird fucking shit happens in that boss fight, including that there is a stand that, like, doesn't undo time, doesn't time travel, it kind of deletes time, but also it's time travel, but it's not really time travel. Uh, and, like, it was just so fucking dumb hearing it all explained all at once, and it was so fucking funny. And we're like, okay, we gotta watch this ridiculous thing. By the time we got up to it, we forgot everything he detailed about that boss fight. It was incredible. <laughs> it was all such total fucking nonsense that we forgot all of it. <laughs> That's awesome. You know, yeah, the, it, also the, the time-related stands are incredibly confusing also, so that helps. You know, it's funny because I read a thing, and I do think it's true that, like, knowing a spoiler, like, actually, like, increases your enjoyment of the thing. But it still feels like, ah, uh, you know, Submit. like, why did you it do that? It depends. On, it depends on the spoiler. Like, if it's a puzzle game and it's about you figuring it out. Oh yeah, yeah. yeah. You know. And I feel like a lot of, you know, Zelda stuff is puzzly. Oh yeah, I know for sure. I don't know, it depends on the person. It depends. Like, if it's a, if it's a plot spoiler, I feel like that's different than if it's like a oh, puzzle oh. spoiler. Oh, you're so close! Damn it. We're almost there. Right, this time I do want to jam on it because I do want to try again. All right, because I keep running out of money and this is ridiculous. Because I <laughs> you got all the time in the world. <laughs> it's true. I'm waiting till 6 p.m. I think, right, for the day two. Right? Yeah. I am. I'm like literally losing track of time, strangely. Which is, <laughs> shoot. Okay, wait. This is the same map. I think it's the same. Wait, no, it's in the middle. It looks like shoot. Roughly. This yeah, it map? also it depends how much you value surprises and also how you take those spoilers slash hints because you might just be a person that feels insulted when mm -hmm. people help you like i had to deal with those types at my former job a lot where it's just like okay these dads that are playing this escape room really want to win but they're dads and they don't mm -hmm. play puzzle games so i have to figure out creative ways to help them without feeling making them feel like I think they're dumb, and I'm mm. condescending to them by helping right. them. Hey. hey! Piece of heart. Piece of heart! Piece of heart! <laughs> I did have fun. Try again. No. Thank Yay. you. Yay! <laughs> I, never, I never have to do your treasure maze again, lady. <laughs> that was a weird thing to say. Let's go. All right. Um, actually, it wasn't, but... Uh, let's see here. You know, by the way, speaking of weird things to say, and I tweeted about this, but I just want to repeat it, because you know how, like, Nicolas Cage is a good actor, but even when he says something normally, it sounds a little weird because it's Nicolas Cage? Yeah. I so I keep trying to watch Pig, and I'm like, we did our third attempt, and my wife fell asleep again, which is, like, a common oh theme my in God. my life. She, she's, like, incredible at sleeping. She's great. At, I mean, I'm the opposite. It's weird. Yeah, you know? like, like I mean, I feel like usually it's men that just, like, fall fucking asleep at a drop of a hat, right? My my, my boyfriend's mm -hmm. like that. And it's just, like, he can just sleep wherever if he wants to. And it's just, I'm incredibly jealous because I can be laying in the comfiest bed and it's just like, I'm wide fucking awake. Uh, but yeah, your wife seems to have a, a, a knack for falling asleep during movies. It's insane, yeah. No, I, I usually takes like five or six attempts. In series, like, you're screwed. You know what I mean? Like, if you want to watch oh a God. show, you're just done. But, like, I, like, have to go ahead and then, pre like, pretend some that, like, that would, like, piss me off. <laughs> <laughs> I, wouldn't, I wouldn't be able to have a partner that falls asleep every time I try to watch, like, <laughs> anything longer than a show with. That would, like, genuinely enrage me. <laughs> Kudos What's to funny, you. We have we have different tastes and things, you know. So like, there's like stuff then like I'll want to watch like that's like sci-fi or like horror. Well, she likes horror too, but like you know what I mean. Like mm. so it's like fine, you know. Like she can't she can't do like like anything like n too nerdy, you know. Like anime is just a non-starter, you know. So, oh like, man. I know. I kind of want her to get her opinion on certain things, but like 
Like, she would not. Like, JoJo would be funny in concept, but she JoJo would, do would it. be so stupid with her. Oh my god. No, She'd be yes. so confused, but she would have the funniest. She's, like, really funny. Um, She's very funny, yeah. <laughs> she would have the funniest, like, takes on it. Mm. You know, but, like, um, but Pig at one point. Oh, wait, I did the wrong one. I was trying to do opponent. Um, what it, because he goes, like, he just goes, like, I don't fuck my pig. Which is, like, a totally weird, like, because this. <laughs> A guy makes a joke at his expense is why that happens, yeah, yeah, you know? Yeah, yeah. And he kind of ignores it and he's responding to that. But it's just like you kind of sit there and like, I just heard Nicolas Cage just say that. It's so weird. <laughs> and apparently he's really like, it's a great movie, but I just haven't yeah, finished yeah, it or yeah. gotten there yet, you know? I, ha but. I haven't watched it yet, but I've been meaning to. I also haven't seen Mandy and I need... Um, I really... I recently watched Kiss of the Vampire. And that was just so good. Uh, Kiss of the Vampire, if you haven't seen it... You might have seen a clip of it where um, Nicolas Cage is running down a Manhattan street screaming, I'm a vampire, I'm a vampire, I'm a vampire! <laughs> <laughs> uh, it's great. It's really good. There's a couple of really funny like, therapy scenes where he's losing his shit at his therapist. It's <laughs> really like, it's a very strange movie. Um, I cannot tell what its like intention was mood wise because it's very funny um, and I don't know if it's supposed to be. It's one of those movies. Mm -hmm. um, and I also saw Nicolas Cage in Color Out of Space and I was like, holy shit, this guy's a really good actor. <laughs> <laughs> oh yes, Andorra, that is the movie where he shouts the entire alphabet at his therapist and I forget why he was doing that but he was fucking pissed off about it, whatever he was doing. <laughs> it's excellent. I should have stalked the mailman too, I just realized. Oh, you have to put those documents in alphabetical order. A, B, C, D. <laughs> <laughs> oh, what a guy. What a guy. If, if, if it came out that he was a secret fucking sex pest, sex pest deuce bag, I'd be pretty bummed out about that. <laughs> I, yeah, I don't know. You know what's funny too? Because he does method acting things, but not the obnoxious stuff that you'd hear. You know what I mean? Yeah, like, yeah. It's like, apparently for leaving Las Vegas, he would film himself being really drunk and talking. You know what I mean? And that's as far mm -hmm. as it went. It wasn't like, I'm going to go, you know, yeah. shave into a jar and send it to, you know, my friends my or something. My coworkers. Yeah, yeah exactly. It's, it's not at the expense of his coworkers. Right, yeah. Like, I don't, I think that's where method acting definitely needs to have a line drawn because I feel like <laughs> the ones that are... The ones that are doing method acting that everybody's like, Jesus fucking Christ, just stop it. It's because it, yeah. they're, they're bringing other people into their bullshit. <laughs> <laughs> just do it alone. <laughs> Don't ruin other people's works. Members. Mayor Carnival, please order those to remain. Uh, to evacuate. <laughs> I think this is the fourth time you've, <laughs> you've seen this conversation. Well, no, actually, this is... Oh, is it the same one? Because it's on the second <laughs> day, but... I was thinking, okay. But the answer is the answer. Carnival should not be canceled. You're right. Mr. Mayor, the answer won't decide. People don't drag the merchant soldiers into this. Yeah. I'm just trying to wonder, like, then what I am I supposed their to do? The mouths. The inside of their mouths? Like, oh, it's they're awful. just eldritch in there. This <sighs> is terrible. <laughs> Bring my wife into this. The wife, okay. And the wife is, is isn't she looking for um what's it's, uh the isn't she? It's, no no no. Uh, I feel like she was looking for no Madame Moreau. Yes, that is that's mm -hmm. right. Yeah, she was looking for Cafe, which right, is cause... her son and the mayor's son. Right. And he's we've due never... to be betrothed on the eve of the carnival, but he has run run off somewhere. He's missing, and everyone thinks like, oh, he's just ditching. He's just yeah. ditching his wife at the altar. I don't know. Oh, we never did Skulltula Palace either, now I just realized, too. You can't yet. Okay. Because you need, like, a hook shot or something. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, there's a million places for seeds, which stinks because seeds are real. Seeds are really hard to get in this game? They're um, a little bit hard, yeah. I don't know why. I mean, they mostly, they pretty much all lead to a heart piece. Or something juicy. In some I guess sense. I should. Yeah. I you guess can I also, should if, you want six, if you want 6 p.m. to roll around faster. He could, he could speed up time. So I thought that, but then I was like kind of afraid in some ways, you know, uh -huh. that it wouldn't, uh, it wouldn't, um, that it would go too far or like I'd waited too long, which now that I'm thinking about it makes absolutely no sense, you know? 
but well, as long as you uh, you know, zoom over to Milk Road like right now. I mean, you should have played that when you at Milk Road. <laughs> oh shit. Um. Whoops. No, no, wait. <laughs> All right, whatever. Fine. Buddy. <laughs> I also meant speeding up time, not skipping ahead, but that's okay. Oh, I see what you mean, yeah. <laughs> I thought you meant, like, skipping ahead. To... Alright, got it. I think this should be fine. We'll find out. Sure hope so. Because <laughs> it's annoying to redo the UFO shit. <laughs> okay, run your Goron ass right into that ranch. Wrong way. No, yeah. <laughs> Wait. No, oh, buddy. Guess what? I think you missed it. Get on get on your horse. Wait. Where are you? You like riding. You can't, you like you, you can't ride your horse's uh, Goron Link, by the way. I know, but we are, we can multitask. Mm -hmm. See? You came. Go, 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 go. Get on, Link. Okay. This is not working out well for me. No, it's not. Well, I could do I could do skip skip, right? I mean, if I really needed to like, skip skip, like restart the timeline and oh, more Pona. Well, yeah, you have to you have to do the UFO thing all over again. That's what I was saying. Oh shit, you're right. Crap. Okay. Is there any way I can get can around? Can you go? This? Can you go around the fence if you can't jump it? Yeah. Uh, go this way. Maybe they'll let you in. Nope. Oh boy. This is No, keep going, sucks. keep going, keep going, keep going. I don't think that goes all the way around. No. You're right. Oh my gosh. Okay. <laughs> oh boy. Maybe, well, okay. You know what? That could, that could, All right. I have I have mitigation plans, but you know, we'll, we'll figure it out. Okay. I'd love I'd love for you to learn that it, like Destroying all your carrots is not the most efficient way to use a Pona. <laughs> I know, but I'm like, I'm scared now. Can I just go this way? Yeah, this is the way I'm supposed to go. Actually, let's see. Go let's see if uh, you're late or not. Let's see. Go, 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 go. Ride like the wind. Link. Link. Oh, no, no, no. Link. 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 <laughs> Can't believe we, we did Gran Turismo just for... Terrible. Let's see. Let's see. Is she around? Come on. Come oh, on. she's still here. You lucky bean. Oh, brother. Watch you like, oh, oh, boy, like immediately. Talk to this hoe. Okay. What the? No. Talk. Your phone is in the fucking way. <laughs> there we go. Phew. Oh, good evening. Oh, you the luckiest man alive. Woo! Oh, you the luckiest man alive. I was like, I don't know when she leaves, but woof. Hi, <laughs> welcome company. Wait, why does she have a steering wheel for a horse? I, isn't it adorable? <laughs> um, that's a donkey. It's not. A, that's a donkey. That looks a like a donkey, donkey to me. Father died. Of Whoa! This is sad. Just unload on me. Seriously. And then it's gonna be my like, ranch. It's gonna be like that scene with Skullface then where it's just a completely awkward thing in a minute. Uh, <laughs> this is going pretty fast too, this test. Yeah, wow. I'm like not pressing anything just for the record. <laughs> it's fucking going. I don't know why it's being so fast. But yeah, someone's been fucking up their ranch. She's got a friend in town named Anju. She's the one getting married. Maybe it's a Clydesdale. <laughs> Clydesdale donkey. Wait, uh, okay. So how are you going to go through this? What? The road. Get your bow ready. Boy, get your bow ready. Lo Loinky, get your gun. What the heck? Oh, maybe What's it's a about? mule. Is this more aliens? Oh, it must be if it's the alien thing. 
but well maybe I shouldn't say must be but now we're gonna learn it was like really old man Malon or whatever <laughs> first milk roads blocked by a boulder and now we have to take this detour ugly, ugly country. country it's just a racetrack <laughs> next year it's next year <laughs> she's calling the Gorman brothers fucking ugly here we go My cargo of milk bottles. Do you understand? No, actually, I don't, but she'll repeat it. So, you know, like, I'm... I don't understand, but I'll do it. <laughs> just say yes. The tattle's like whispering. Like, just, just say you do. Just say yes. Just, just get through. I'll have a big thanks for you. Okay. Loink, just roll with it. Oh, brother. We call that road milk. All right, here we go. Yeah, when they do that, oh, it means they're about to break one of the milk bottles and you need to hit them. And yeah, thankfully, you don't have to worry about ammo in this part. It's way easier than UFO part. Yeah, let's just let's just go with with the rapid fire. <laughs> Here we go. Yeah, who could these two be? I have no idea. Jeez. Who could be sabotaging the nearby ranch? Who's super jealous of the nearby ranch and all the, the incredible milk? That seems to be treated as as nicely as a fancy alcohol in this world. They call us the, for it. The Morgan Brothers, or the Gorman Brothers, was actually our our fake identity. <laughs> Captain Gorman. Oh dear! Hey, 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 hey! I love that even their mules are ugly. <laughs> Buck teeth. <laughs> is, is there like a special reward for doing it with all three, or do you just need one? Like all three it? what? All three like milk bottles and such, you know. Or oh no, it's, a, it's the same. Got I think. It, okay. So far as I know. I was happy to get first delivery in quite a while. Thank you. You were pretty cool. Art piece. Oh, what the milk Romani's mask? <laughs> oh, the ma the milk bar. Yeah. A child becomes an adult. Limited number of adult customers. Proof of membership. I now she acknowledge. Gave you she gave you a fake ID for the bar. <laughs> <laughs> That's... Tonight you've become a man. <laughs> thank you for the thank you. So yeah, now doing... you you have the ability to access the bar whenever. Whoa! So well, when it's open. Uh, 10 p.m. It opens, I think, right? Uh, I believe so. Yeah. Or by 10 p.m. Well, I mean right now. It's open, but it's not like open. Like there's Oh right, there. yeah. yeah. <laughs> Let's see. Let's see if this this jerk's tricked. I'm gonna uh, get drunk. <laughs> yes, I'm here for the milk. <laughs> Hello, I am an adult. Turn at night. I'm getting things ready. If you just wish to talk, though, you can hang out and talk to nobody. That's nobody. Just that's Mario weird. with with moo pants. <laughs> Look at they have all different kinds I, and plates. I mm -hmm. would kill for a pop up bar that looks exactly like like this. <laughs> like, oh my god, like a Chateau Romani milk bar, and all of the drinks are like dairy cocktails and stuff like that, and like adult smoothies, like those alcoholic milkshakes and stuff like that. Oh my god, that'd be so I cute. <laughs> I feel like I feel like Japan has like places like that. You know what I mean? Like uh, those video like games that themed. look like that. But I want like a, a fucking Majora's Mask one, which would never happen. No, probably not. No, never, <laughs> never. What do you call it? I heard. Oh, that was the other one. Hi, hi. Clockwork Ducky. Orange has a milk bar. It's true. It does. But uh, let's see here. Um, I, what else can we do? I so, don't know. You know what's funny is I read the book Clockwork Orange after the movie, and oh, yeah. there's there's this 21st chapter that wasn't published, you know, and everybody, you know, the, the book's like, now finally you can see the complete version with the 21st chapter, and it's awful. It's the worst <laughs> chapter ever, because it's like Alex and them are all grown up, and they're just and like... Living a productive, normal life. Yeah! Actually, bullshit. <laughs> it totally is. They're just like, oh, how are you doing? Good, good. Glad we grew out of that period of our lives. You know, uh, like they don't explicitly say that, but they kind of do. And you're just like, really? Uh, this is like bygones be bygones. Yes, I brutally yeah. raped and murdered uh, somebody. Mm -hmm. But yeah. man, what are you going to do? It's just boys being boys. You know, <laughs> that was it was like literally that. And then like 
the oh, author was like, thankfully, you know, because I felt 21 was the age. He said something to like, 21 is the age, whatever, when you, I, I'm like, drinking in the U.S.? What are you talking about? You know, it was like, uh, totally stupid. Like, no, one, well, like, no wonder it wasn't published. They're just like, get the, get rid of it. <laughs> the editor was like, this is going to put me out of business. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, yeah, it's funny when you like can, uh, you can mm -hmm. speed up time if you want oh, for right. 10 p.m. to roll around quicker. Wait, is that that's rat? No, that's Dardar, -dar, right? Yes, that's Dardar. -dar. Mm -hmm. Dardar. -dar. Dawn it ready, dawn it ready. No, no, no. That's it's a uh, double around rotation. You know, meaning the Earth. Sure. Yeah, why not? I don't know if we're gonna. <laughs> I don't know if we're gonna figure it out. Rad, rad is just remember rad, rad backwards. Dardar. -dar. Rad, rad. Dardar, I mean, that works. Right? Dardar Binks, exactly. The, Dardar the, the, Binks. The, the, gun, the Gungan. Can I do something about the fairy? I forget. The the bubble. Uh, what? Isn't that just... I mean, does it run out of time, the Jinx, or do I have to hit, like, the it other... It runs out of time. Okay, yeah. It's it's a timed uh, situation. That's right. Yeah, there we go. Thank you. Uh, ten. Let's go in. Please come in. Owner Rather short story. for an adult human being, but come in, please. Please do not speak about my stature please. as a member of the milk bar. I feel like I've earned more. We get all types here. <laughs> not judgment, T sir. Just tiny enough, men. Just for an example. observation. Tiny men that look like boys. <laughs> come on in. Let's see what. Hello. What? The, what the H? Oh yeah. You've met this guy before. I forget his name. It's something really good, though. Performance. Okay, you play the ocarina. Stand under the center spotlight. I can do that. Yes. URLR. You don't have to remember this. Don't worry about okay. it. I was going to say you are a liar. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, no. There's an A there. You are a liar. <laughs> You've insulted everyone at this bar. <laughs> okay. That feels good. All right. <laughs> What's that guy's deal? What would you like added to that song? Play Freebird. Milk. It's milk. Can you get tipsy from something like milk? Oh. I wonder what the try. original dialogue was like. <laughs> You've had too much already, buddy. Keeper, got some good milk in tonight. Would you like some Romani for your final moon, moon viewing? That's creepy. I'll have a drink. What'll it be? Uh, you can buy regular milk here at any point if you want. Mm -hmm. uh, or the Chateau Romani, which uh, is really good milk that, if I'm not mistaken, uh, recharge it, like keeps your um, FP. Uh, like Elden Ring, keeps your magic meter from depleting or something like that. Like it's very, like it's like a full heal and it also keeps your magic meter from depleting for some amount of time. It was interesting that the guys like give me a call, you know what I mean? When when you'd make up your mind, which is like, I didn't know we had phones here in turn. <laughs> hey! Okay, you play the ocarina, go standard. Oh, I bet I know what to do here. Hold on. I bet, well, I bet. Mm -hmm. I can just stop saying I bet. I bet. We can do other instruments, too. Oh, infinite magic forever until you reset. That's pretty wow. good. Pretty good. Can you help me with the performance? Okay, you play the pipes. Go stand under the front left spotlight. I like how he just, like, knows. Like, by race. Like, oh. All, oh you, all you Dekus play the pipes, right? I, I, I can tell you got pipes hidden under your hat, I hope. <laughs> <laughs> Up your ass! <laughs> oh, biological pipes. Wow, that is creepy. Now that I've anyway, <laughs> that feels good. What feels good? Fuck you! <laughs> this is all garbage. I'm drunk off milk. Damn it! <laughs> <laughs> My life's in the gutter. I'm drunk off milk. <laughs> this is the, this is rock bottom. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa, hey there, big boy. Help me with a performance. <laughs> the rear left spotlight. You got it. All right. Play How come the drum? biggest boy gets the smallest spotlight? 
That, that was pretty simple. He doesn't think much of my musical ability. <laughs> Just hit that. Now we're jamming. It's not really becoming a song, in my opinion, though. I'm kind of with drunk, milk drunk guy. <laughs> All right, that feels good. We're almost there. We'll teach you to appreciate jam sessions. Hello, sir. I'm Azora. You haven't seen before? Of course <laughs> I can help you. Gosh, you look like this, the spitting image of Mikawa, our no. guitarist. Too bad Indeed. he's dead. I am Mikau. All right, that's my, that's my Harley Quinn Clayface. I'm just stealing that a bit now, so <laughs> I'll just stop here. That's a really good show, by the way, if you haven't seen it. Um, all right. This is a one-man show. That's right, but when you're a guest can move at the speed of time and appear in four places at <laughs> once, what to say <laughs> is happening now. Nah, it's just still crap. I'm sorry. Oh, what the? I like it. <laughs> <laughs> that was the best. That melody. Oh. Back to oh. Girls, stand by. This is just like the end of Coco. <laughs> oh, the windfish. Indiegogo's made famous. Windfish, like from Link's Awakening. Yeah. Chill business, because I heard this car here on the second to last day of the world. I finally found my purpose. What is with his neck? What is that? He's happening? very, he's very hairy. It goes all the way up. <laughs> he like did he still? He was like, I can't shave that even lower, any lower than this. I'm sorry. <laughs> the singers of that song, original Lulu, mother of the current lead singer, who's also named Lulu. Oh boy, this is getting like uh -huh. dark. Hmm. Oh, he is really hairy. Sorry, I booed you. Please take, <laughs> please take my mask. Oh, the circus leader's mask. Aww. What? A tear even in a demon's eye? It's a, very... it's a really sad mask. Gorman. He's the third Gorman brother. He ran off to join the circus instead of be a a ranch guy. It's the rules. Wear the mask in the bar. Come on, kid. I already let you we're gonna, in. We gotta, we're going to kick you out if you don't wear, wear this mask. <laughs> we're going to lose our liquor, our milk license if <laughs> this is talking to kids. All right. Now I got your... When I, I was back at the are. ranch, my brothers, I wonder how they are. If you wear yeah, his own mask at him, what happens? One way to find I out. Well, there's I don't ways. remember. We so could also like, I... look it up on GameFAQs. I guess there's more than one way. But still, here. You won't even mask, look at me. Same thing. He, the mask is so quieting. Boo hoo hoo hoo! <laughs> Let's see here. All right, that's like pretty much all the important stuff to do in that bar. All right. Nice. Um, now so we got a mask of a crying adult man. We could talk to. I, he said like he remembered Lulu who's singing, right? So. Wait, who was Lulu again? She was not. <laughs> Was she in the... No, that's Ingu um. or whatever is when getting married. Who? What? <laughs> no, I'm trying to remember because he was saying like, that reminds me of Lulu, whose daughter Lulu, who's also named Lulu, is singing. You know, all uh -huh. that jazz. Yeah. And I'm like, did I meet Lulu? You know? You have met Lulu. Um, was Lulu in the hotel? Like the inn, the straw horse Who, who inn or do whatever you think? They... What, what race do you think Lulu is? Well, I would have thought Zora that she's like that one who sings or whatever, but then I'm like, you know. Yeah, what? that's this. Do you remember the Zoras? They have yeah, a problem because their singer can't sing? That's Lulu. Yeah. yeah. But, but I'll be honest, and maybe this is my own prejudices bubbling up to the surface and a, an opportunity for personal growth. I'm like, a human singing with Zoras? That can't be right. But <laughs> Well, it's an all Zora band. True. And you did meet a Zora female. Mm -hmm. Who has a big problem? Vis-a-vis mm -hmm. -vis the band mm -hmm. and the eggs, right, and her right, boyfriend's right. dead, and you're wearing yeah, his yeah. skin and face. Right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's but magically, so. Yeah, 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 yeah. He, he. I think he consented to wearing his flesh and his fats and his bones. Gotcha. Right. <laughs> magically, so. Yeah, magically. 
We kind of glossed over that part, I think. Yeah, no, I know. I mean, uh, it was implied, at least. Yeah. Yeah, you'll yeah, be, yeah. You'll be assuming my identity via a mask? You know. Yeah, it's fine. Not quite a mission if not a live a mission if they don't ask, right? Yeah, sure, whatever. Um But what if I said hi to you like this? God, you're making me more sad. <laughs> hmm. Is Nothing. there anything we should be uh doing if you check the uh the yeah, bomber notebook? Is there anything good happening around this time? Let's see. Um I think there is we got that, I got that. End of postman. I can just run back for Postman. That's like the only thing it looks like. And then... I don't think you'll make Postman. I don't think anything's really happening. Yeah. Um, I mean, it wouldn't be terrible to restart I... your day right now. Oh, that's what like I'm thinking. Out of Unless you want to explore a little around here. Um, deposit your money. Look really sad. I could cry a bunch. To be pensive and stuff, you know. It's okay to let it out. <laughs> No. It's okay to cry. It is. You know what? It and is. I wanna I wanna go on it's, record it, saying it is, it, yes. I wanna go on record saying it rules to cry. It does, it's great. I recommend it. I cry all the time. It's fucking great. If you listen to the Devil May Cry 5 song, Devil Trigger, there's a line like, gotta let it out, gotta let it out. And they're talking about, you know, being a demon and shooting things, but I like to think they also mean emotionally, you do have to let it yeah. out. Yeah. You know, yeah. Let it out. True. Cry a bit. Crying exactly. crying is fun. It is. Yeah. <laughs> mm. I cried no, yesterday when I said goodbye to my friends who hung out with me all weekend. I was like, I missed you guys. <laughs> yeah. Kid stuff will get you there easy. It yeah, was a I nice cry. Believe me. No, I, um, you know, it's funny because I've been trying to, um, get more into that. Because I, I, I was always kind of grown up with the whole, like, nah, you got to bury all that. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. And I, no, I did this really regrettable thing. Not, re not like really regrettable, like I'm going to make some big confession <laughs> or something. But, like, um, no, I had this stream when my son was born because I would stream because, like, they would just, they, when they were babies, you know, like they wouldn't have a sleep schedule. So I'd be like, yeah. up in the morning, whatever. <laughs> I was playing Earthbound. I had my webcam off. And at one point, he was starting to stir. So I pick him up. And there's a part in Earthbound where Ness, the kid, is in this mm -hmm. pyramid. And he talks, and you talks, and then he like walks, and all of a sudden the screen like goes white, and then it says like Ness. While I was holding my son, it said Ness had an image of his father holding him. Oh. This is like so. It's like oh, you know. And then like I I posted about it, but then like I was like I tried I couched it like you know like oh this made me all like I did, I was like I, I didn't want to say emotional or anything you know because it was like really touching or whatever you know but oh. and then I'm like that's stupid I can be like that you know what I mean later uh -huh. or, like the next day I'm like I should have just said. So now I'm like, you know, whatever, but. That's so sweet. I know, Na and that's also where I'm like, I really gotta just do the webcam from now on, this is stupid. You know what I mean? Like, this is ridiculous. <laughs> that would've been great if it was just on, but I turned oh. it on holding him, you know, but. Oh, that is too cute. Love that story. Let's see here. I love um, games that make me cry. Like, that's one of the reasons that this game is so special to me, and I've been thinking about this a lot, because I've been wondering like, oh, should I do like a hot takeouts video essay mm -hmm. about this or something? Mm-hmm. Cause it's not just like, oh, it's a really good game. Like it's like, no, like it's it's good because like it was like the first game that I played at least that like was more than just like we fun video game. And it's like we it's fun and interesting and I'm intrigued. But like also like, wow, that was sad. Like mm -hmm. there's a lot of sad shit in this game. Like a game could make me cry until I played this game. And you know I was like fucking you know 13, 14 or whatever. Um, but I was like, damn, games can do this. What the fuck? Mm -hmm. And then later when I was 17 or so, I played Silent Hill 2, and I was like, okay, my whole life is going to revolve around <laughs> <It's> like, <laughs> around this, but also around, like, the idea that games can, like, fuck you up in this kind of way. Like, that's so good. <laughs> yeah. It'll make you cry for different reasons, mate. You know what I mean? There's different yeah, emotionals yeah. that, no. Um... <laughs> but it's like, you know, games can elicit more than just, like, we, I'm having fun, but still have value in this other way. Right. And it's like, it sucks that there's some people out there that, like, don't find value in being you know sad and just find it manipulative like ugh. right like I, f I felt a little bummed out that like you know when we were talking on uh game of the year discussions um that uh gerson was saying that he found unpacking to be like like schmaltzy i think i don't mm -hmm. remember exactly how he phrased it so forgive me if i'm uh putting words in his mouth here sure uh but he kind of phrased it that it, it seemed as though he felt it was emotionally manipulative 
Mm. And I was oh. like, what? <laughs> no. Like, I mean, in, in the sense that they're trying to manipulate your emotions by appealing to them, I guess. I d know. Yeah, like, you know, what? I mean, that just kind of makes me sad for, like, what, what do movies do? <laughs> like, you know, like, I don't know. Like, that was just kind of a weird... Not like a, not like a weird take, but I was just like, man, I don't... Really... A, I don't agree, and B, like, is that bad even if? Like, I don't really... <laughs> it's not... Like, they're... There's cheap emotional manipulation where it's yeah. just like, oh, like, we need some pathos. Oh, guess what? The dog died in this movie. You know, there's that, that yeah. shit like that. Like, cheap shit. But it's like, unpacking is not that. Like, oh my goodness. Like, it's so <laughs> intricately, beautifully, like, you know, environmental storytelling bullshit that, like, most people can re relate to. And yeah, if that's emotionally manipulative, uh, oops, that's being a human. <laughs> you had a feeling. <laughs> like, you know, I don't know. One of my um one of the games I get a little emotional about, which is like also because of when I was like younger and stuff, was Snatcher, and not because like such big emotional beats are hit, because like this is before anyone had any idea who Hideo Kojima was, so it was like this like weird Terminator Blade Runner ripoff like adventure yeah. game. And you're like, what the hell is this crap? And then all of a sudden it goes places, and you're like totally blindsided by it, you know. <laughs> But then, yeah, I mean, it's crap, you know, whatever, but, like, <laughs> it's crap, but it's my crap, you know, that kind yeah, of thing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, absolutely. So. Yeah, but, like, yeah, Silent, yeah, but Silent, I think Silent, Silent Hill 1, I was, like, the one where I'm, like, holy shit, this is a horror game. Like, this is scary, mm. you know? And then 2 is, like, that next level of, like, that was, I remember, like, just, like, I had to put down the controller early on for, like, five minutes, or, not five minutes, but you know what I mean? Just, like, yeah, yeah. I, like, just pause the game and be, like, do I really want to play this? That was really, free, you know, it was, yeah. Like, yeah. It's really good stuff. <laughs> yeah, I think I feel like the only reason, because I was like a bit of a scaredy cat growing up, and um, the only reason uh, an ex-boyfriend let me le lent Silent Hill 2 to be for five fucking days, what a cheapskate, <laughs> um, was because I mentioned that, you know, oh, I like, I like some horror movies, you know, I like the alien movies, Xenomorph. Cool. And he thought I was such a cool girl for knowing that they were called Xenomorphs. Fucking nerd. <laughs> Who cares? Um... <laughs> Uh, that's how I got into a very bad relationship very early on in my life. Anyway, but... <laughs> that's that's with Yutani's plan, ultimately. So Yeah. yeah. <laughs> but, like, yeah, he was like, oh, if you like scary stuff, here's, like, you should play this game style hole too. And I was like, oh, what the fuck? Like, okay, I'll try it. And, like, it was, like... I got, like, midway through the apartments. I think I saw the pyramid head, like, initial scene where he's, you know, kind of fucking that mannequin. Mm -hmm. Uh... And, you know, all throughout, and I think I, maybe I got up to Angela with, with the in the mirror room that scene. Um, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Uh, where she's got the knife and all that. Mm -hmm. And I was just like, yes, it's scary, but I feel like that that's just part of why this is really interesting. This is sad. Like he's looking for his dead wife. Like where? What is? What's gonna happen? Like this is a really intriguing plot. Yeah, right. It wasn't something that. It wasn't something that games did at all in 2001 a plot like that that's like immediately a bummer your wife's fucking dead this is about man pain it was like the first man pain game <laughs> <laughs> and because all the other games where it was like man pain it was just get revenge god of war or something <laughs> yeah know? no totally like, you kill you killed my person i cared about and therefore you must <laughs> die violently you know that kind of stuff yeah 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 <laughs> yeah and then yeah james so I was like, like wow well, <laughs> This is different. This guy is like not an action hero. This guy's fucking pathetic and mm. sad. And I'm like really interested in that because I've never seen a really sad, pathetic schmuck before in a video game. <laughs> where's, this gonna, where's this gonna go? <laughs> um, you know, and it's funny because like if you look to all the combat and it's very like clumsy in a way, you know, mm. like everything is slow and he like doesn't hit very well. You know what I mean? It's like it's it's like you know it's not like it's like you have to call it combat because that's literally what it is but it doesn't feel like fighting like in most games you know what i mean yeah like, you're absolutely not like stars like in resident evil or some <laughs> shit you know yeah um god how I, bad would that game be if you could actually fight it's just like a... well i didn't play it didn't one of them you're like an ex-army guy or something yeah I think, we like, don't homecoming. talk about homecoming that's it <laughs> not that the combat was good in homecoming he just had a knife that was way too op <laughs> so go back to where you you were heading there. There's something interesting underwater that I don't think you noticed. I, is it like those wooden kind of things here? Yeah. Can you like uh, get down there and kind of investigate those a little bit? Those That's are weird. funny. I, th I thought I okay. I, maybe I missed this. Maybe I guess I totally missed it. Yeah. All right. Hey, hang on. Does it look strange? 
range? Yeah, of course it does. Uh, let me dive. Hold on. I'm trying to remember how to... There it is. Okay. Punch. Hmm. All right. Well, I don't think bombs would work underwater, but even if they did... <laughs> Sadly, I no. Yeah. So this is a, a tiny bit unintuitive, so I'm wondering if you're going to check it out and stumble upon it yourself or not. Give me one with it. Give me one. Absolutely. Here. So wait, why did Tattle disappear? Or wait, there it is, target. Uh, maybe not. Okay. Um. Were you trying to uh, roll into it like you roll into uh, boxes, crates? I actually was just looking at the prompt that said attack there and uh. like forgetting. I was thinking it was the boomerang thing, actually. You know. Mm -hmm. But oh wait, this one's red. Wait, why is that? Is that one? No, they all are. Okay, never mind. <laughs> it's just maybe the. Right. Okay, so yeah, no, I'm I'm not. Sh Let's see here. What happens if you do this? He just flies up. Yeah. Okay. So I'm, I'm gonna need to be or a link for this, I think. Uh, let's, okay, if there's, they're either covering something up. There. Oh wait, look, the map has one that's like, mm. hmm. So maybe one in particular. Oh, it's browner. Is that it? <laughs> or is it? I can't tell if this is the lighting. They're or... identical looking. <laughs> okay. They, but they do, you know, only one of them does something or leads somewhere. <laughs> See, yeah, I think, like, if I'm looking at the map, it seems this one lines up with that passage there. For you sure, know? yeah. For sure, for sure. I don't think I can use items as underwater as Zor, and mm. I don't have any anyway, I don't think. Yeah, so. no, you can't. Uh, is this... No, I can't use it anyway. Huh. Um... Uh, maybe it's like Elden Ring where you have to do the thing a hundred times. <laughs> it's, it's, it's a bug, <laughs> but oh, there, there we are. That was <laughs> completely by accident, actually. Yes, exactly, exactly. <laughs> <laughs> Just how I wanted it. <laughs> hey, pirates! For oh, this is stealth. I can already tell from that. Oh, it's water stealth. Can I just be on the bottom? Are those motorboats? Is that what I'm hearing? Those are motorboats. What the h? <laughs> I like this song a lot. Oh, I've heard this song. I remember it. Hey, you, halt. What? How? How, lady? They're very good at their jobs. <laughs> Sorry, that was kind of funny. <laughs> Get that. the fuck out! <laughs> that's, that's pretty good. Whoa, hello. Ooh. Die, friend. <laughs> I don't think you should get too close. But... I love how he stands with one hand on his hip. How fucking cool is he? <laughs> that is good. That's a power pose. I had a crush on Zora Link growing up, not gonna lie. <laughs> I mean, look at him. He's a, he's a fish and he's a dish. <laughs> the first fish crush <laughs> ever. <laughs> Before Shape of Water, nice ass fish. Before <laughs> uh, Prince Sidon, there was... <laughs> <laughs> I don't know that I ever had a fish crush. Although I, I do call oh, my wife. Oh come on, fish. Rudo! You never you never did a little Rudo like say, lady. Let me Google Rudo. Hold on. What is R U T O? R U T O. N sixty four. Ocarina of Time. William Rudo, Deputy President of Kenya. Uh, oh yeah, that's... he's really hot. Um. <laughs> you know. All right. If you like if you like guys who wear yellow ties, I guess. Um, N sixty four. It's the same model as Lulu, but. She's practically naked. She's like Zora nude. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Leeds Leedsy says, "Don't forget Voidburger. He said he didn't play Ocarina of Time." No, I, I played it. I just like yeah, he played it. <laughs> I, I finished it like years ago though. He like, played it when was, it came out. Yeah, like when I was like like literally two decades, I think. Now, yeah, right? yeah, yeah. Wow. <laughs> all right, what's the deal? What's the deal with? All right, so we got. But yeah, Zora with her circling. with her Rudo with her. Fish biddies out. I was like, say, I'm 12 and I don't know I'm bisexual, but I'm interested in looking at you. <laughs> well, I've, you know, honestly, I've had now two streams where I have talked about Ronnie from uh, Elden Ring 
Um, so I'm gonna I'll I'll leave it. I'll leave the filth for Be, a little being bit. Being a hottie. <laughs> Actually, no. I was saying like I I know because she's like the cat's pajamas on the internet lately, you know. And I'm like the I don't cat's pajamas. As the as the kids say, you know. Yeah. Uh, but. No, I, 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 I don't know. I, I never, like, I didn't know, like, the forearms thing didn't really do it for me, you know? <laughs> and, like, cause I, and I was thinking the logistics of it. Because I'm like, three hands tops, right? And then somebody was like, well, the fourth hand could be holding a sandwich. And I'm like, for her or me? Because, like, <laughs> you know, I'm flattered by, like, the notion that, like, you know, she needs to keep her strength up, you know? But let's, you know, nah, come on, you know? Nah. nah. And then for me, it's like... I can't, I, I'm not coordinated enough to eat while I'm, like, getting wanked off or something. You know what I mean? Like, I'm not, like, it's like the pat your head, rub your tummy master mode. It, it's not, you know, I'm no good at all that. Come on now. Master mode. Man, it master is. Master bait mode. Master bait mode. Yes, exactly. <laughs> exactly. Oh. You know what I'm talking about. So, yeah, oh, no, no. I, oh, I mean, brother, as you say. Oh, brother, yeah. Oh, I have brother. Been, oh, brother. She's the um, bee's knees, she's the pet cat's pajamas, and she can <laughs> jack me off 15 different ways. That's yeah, exactly. And she you know. is of an undetermined ancient age while being in a very suspiciously youthful looking body. <laughs> mm hmm. Mm hmm. And you know what? Big floppy hat. Yeah, big floppy yeah. hat. That's my fetish. <laughs> you know, I wouldn't go for a fetish, but I like, I like big floppy hat. I don't care. Ladies, floppy. get you a big floppy hat. You know, listen. There's something like there's something something about a big floppy hat, I guess. <laughs> so alluring. Um, should I? Okay, so there's. I'm all about Blythe, so whatever. I've I've chosen my loyalties. Uh, Blythe. Oh, the guy with the the dog head yeah, mask. Yeah, Blythe. Guy? Yeah, I could see Blythe that. Blythe is a hottie. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, he's got yeah. He's basically just guts. They put guts in the game. <laughs> I need to watch Berserk though. You know I. I um I was thinking today about like how it could potentially have ended, you know, like uh, berserk. Yeah, because you know the creator died, so yeah, he like, died. Yeah, yeah. So like it can't, you know, it can't end on like obviously like however if he ever had an ending in mind or anything like that, you know, and because you know, I think somebody put it on um on SA actually one of the mods said it was some, um one of the good ones was like the normal people ones was like <laughs> it's like. He phrased it as like humanistic determination versus nihilistic free will. No, humanistic free will versus nihilistic predestination. And like, that's mm. like the ultimate thing of it where it's like, like he's ultimately fighting a battle. He can't win, blah, 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 you know? Uh -huh. mm. So it's like, does it make sense that he ultimately does and he's rewarded for that? Or is it just like a despairing mm. kind of, you know, thing? And then, um, you know, that having been said, you know, how, you know, like, how would that even go and all that and blah, blah, blah. Mm -hmm. Or is it even, is it not obviously better that the creator, but is and, it better that it's, yeah. Can you, can you pause when you go on a rant? You're, I should, shouldn't I? Yeah. Time flows in this game. I don't know if you know about that yet. Honestly, but, uh... though, too, I was waiting until all these, these jerks. So, oh dear, wait, hold on. <laughs> dive, 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 dive. Yeah, I was waiting for all of them to, like, sort Dive, of, like, dive. <laughs> <laughs> Anywho, but rant. Anyhow. Uh, rant any, anyhow, um. But guts, what a dude! No, uh, <laughs> this is blowing out now. Did I screw that up? Oh, honey, you didn't pay attention to what happened. No, I I hit the. Oh, I thought, honey, I thought the no, I thought the thing opened though. Oh, sweetie, you didn't pay attention. All right, all right, we'll count it. We'll count it. Guess yeah. who has to put a little thing in the not paying attention jar? Guts, but yeah, all right, all right, I'll. Right, I'll <laughs> the so. thing that opened is not that shape or that color, or there yeah. in that area of the map. <laughs> There is a, well, there's a treasure chest in the lower right now, but I did remember Dardar, by the way. Um, oh, nice, 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 nice. Dardar. Thickness. All right, here we go. The one thing about this, though, too, is I feel like there's a really small window for, like, stealth here, you know? Oh, here. yeah, it's very hard. There is a way around it, but I'll see how frustrated we get. <laughs> we, we call that a uh, surface skip. And don't forget, you can, you know, 
swim <laughs> like for real he's like like yeah, zoom around that, yeah it's nice in fact it feels cool and good <laughs> it does it's like i'm trying to figure out how to control like your z axis you know like well or like go up and down you know what i mean that's what i'm trying to say your pitch oh uh, well, my pitch my it's a, it's you know flight controls <laughs> well hmm. well it's when like, it comes to this you just have to you know, yeah, it's yeah. iron boots. Basically, this is just a streamlined version of putting the on and off the iron boots constantly. Mm -hmm. Because in Ocarina of Time, which you don't remember because you played it forever ago, it's actually very fucking annoying no, to I remember. <laughs> deal with the iron boots. Oh, some things I do. I do. Some things don't. You don't <laughs> <forget>. um, <laughs> Constant menu juggling. Yeah. I remember this kind of stuff from good old Tomb Raider 1. But, um... Mm -hmm. The old, the old pull box thing. If I remember too, they like made it really realistic where it would take Laura a really long time to pull a box back. Not like really long, but like enough where it was like, <laughs> oh, come on. All right. You know what I'm trying oh, to do. Oh, that's really obnoxious. You know. But... Oops. Hey, hey, hey. Okay, wait. I want to, I think I, I see a treasure chest there and I feel like if I push it through, I'll be able to walk mm. around. Thank you, Patrick's Parabox, for getting me in the <laughs> box pushing. Yeah, maybe I said that now. I'm totally The Sokoban genre. Yeah, it looks like yeah, you're going to get there later. That. It looks completely blocked off to me. Yeah, I'm going to have to go around on top. All right. All right. You Let's do it. Whoa. Whoa, 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 wait. Okay, okay. Whoa, ho, whoa, whoa, mines. Whoa, 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 whoa. Hey, hey, hey. Okay. <laughs> Come on, come on, pal. There we go. Whoa, hey, flight controls, right? Oh, hey, yeah, ah, shoot. Controls. <laughs> Wait, what happened? Too late. You got pushed oh, into what? the zone. Get, get the, get the heck out of here. Well, hey, more practice uh, swimming around. All right, you're gonna fair. need it. You're going to a water temple soon, so you're gonna want to get a little. Oh controls. yeah. If they, yeah, if they made me like ramp as a Goron, then they're gonna make me. Yeah, like, yeah exactly. Uh, serious. Star Fox kind of swimming. Swim Fox. All right. <laughs> Swim Fox. Swim Fox. I have a bad feeling I'm going to have to redo the box puzzle because it was a little... Oh, wait, wait. Wow. Maybe oh, not. Uh, Majora has smiled upon you this day. Wow. What's that game? On? Oh, that's right. Wizards and Warriors. Yeah. So I want to point out if you... Um, you can destroy some of these mines if you make them crash into each other. And you can do that with um, your... Uh, your boomerang attack mm. but it won't always be feasible because sometimes they won't be close enough together but it's something to keep in mind i say I, I guess they're like trying to teach me that with the two to the two together <laughs> you know but all right stop dive dive okay oh, buddy 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 hey, hey, hey. hey. Well, that's if that's fu that's fucking finicky all yeah, right. These ones don't look like they're quite close enough together. I'm not sure. Uh, you can just walk between them, though. There you go. Yeah, I just want to mention that for the future. Service. Hey, anchor door. One day you'll be so good at the water controls. You're going to be like, how did I ever not understand these? It's so natural now. <laughs> one day that's like when i have to get the excel spreadsheet and like get my best times and things like that there, <laughs> oh well i was gonna say kaizo but there, there is master mode i forgot ocarina of time and ah uh, that shit was so crazy i never, I never so did you so like it's been so long since you played ocarina have you played master mode I think I had it, but I didn't play it. I, I think I got. I, I no, I feel like GameCube re-released um, Ocarina with Master Mode, if I remember. Yes, that's how I played Master Mode. Is that they released it on a disc with uh, Ocarina? Yeah, I think I had that, and I never actually played through it because I had the original N64, which uh, one? Which I don't remember if it was gold or not. I think it was. I was disappointed that Link to the Past was not gold. But Ocarina. Majora's Mask is gold. That's right. That's right. Because I. I think you can roll into these, by the way. Just like they're crates. Maybe. I don't know about that. Maybe it's a weird angle. Maybe. Oh, I don't know. Maybe I'm full shit. Oh, dear. Maybe Goron Link can pick those up, actually. Oh, it is the angle. It's. Ah. Uh, uh, 
It's probably just easier as Goron Link. Recently. Yeah, Majora, Majora's Mask card also had a, a fucking dope-ass lenticular hologram oh. on it. Oh, oh I forgot! You're right! Oh, so cool! Another reason why Majora's Mask is so fucking cool. It's a good, it's a good one. <laughs> I am enjoying it. M more, more lenticular holograms, please, mm -hmm. <laughs> in general. Let's see here. Ba -da, ba -da. Let's see. For some reason, it just feels better to roll into them as Link. I don't know. How much of Berserk have you seen, by the way? Oh, it's very, very, very little. Um, mm. I've seen the outtakes. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know if I've even, I haven't seen the outtakes. Oh my god, it's so funny. <laughs> There's a scene where Guts is like on a horse talking to like trying to rally like some troops to get ready to a battle and, and like whatever he said must be very cool. He raises his hand and then everyone raises their hand and goes, Yeah! <laughs> um, and the voice actor instead he goes, Now who wants to jerk me off? And they go, Yeah! I did <laughs> like, see that. That's right. They've all got their, they've got their fists in the air and they're kind of wiggling <laughs> in a jerk off motion. It's so funny. <laughs> and also the guy who does who plays uh oh I don't know his name but he's got that mask from a uh, fucking Phantom of the Paradise, the big bird mask. Oh, er, I oh Femto yeah okay I think you mean Femto uh, right the bad guy he's know. got like a big. The chat does 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 Voidburger mean Pemto Femto? Am I thinking of the right person? Femto. Femto, yeah. I think it's some other guy. I don't Griffith. Know. It's Griff. I think it's like Griffith's Griffith. like horrible form or whatever. I don't, but, I don't know. Whatever. Um, but uh, there's one where he's that guy, whoever he is, is at the bottom of a pit and he's all fucked up and demented. And for some reason, the voice actor starts singing, uh, Darkness imprisoning me. All that I see. Absolute horror. I don't know the words. <laughs> Oh man, I hear that guy's a dick, right? <laughs> um, oh, what's his face? Um, James Hetfield, the lead singer of Metallica. No, no, I mean oh. the voice actor. <laughs> oh yeah, I don't know. I honestly, I have enough trouble with like, um, with like normal video game drama stuff that I, I, mm. you know, probably like. I feel like nine times out of ten, like yeah, that's he's a dick. You know what I mean? Like whoever it is, you know, yeah, right. it's just like yeah, you're probably, you know, a likelihood. Exactly. It's there. Um, yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's see here. No, um, so I, I watched the 90s anime of Berserk, which Whoa. is how I got into it. And um, what's great is there's this really iconic scene you might have heard about called the Eclipse. And it's a very hopeless scene. And there's uh, a character who continues the story named Skull Knight that they just skip in the 90s anime. So you say... <sighs> How do they advance the plot then without the character? And the answer is they just fucking don't. And it ends on a big cliffhanger that never ever gets resolved and could never be resolved. Great. Yeah. Wonderful. So I'm like, this Excellent news. sucks. And then I learned about, you know, oh, there's a manga and you got blah, blah, blah. You know, this is, this feels like a mini water temple when I'm in right now, you know, but mm. this feels weird. Or then I expected something else to happen with that. Water elevator. Okay, I get it. I have to go here, and then with the time limit, then I go here and... Yeah, but... Yeah, the 90s anime is the Betting. worst thing for that. But then also, there's the 2006 one, I think, where it's, like, all computer animated, and they didn't... Mm. They cut a lot of corners. Oh, yeah! You know? <laughs> I saw that one of Guts, like, walking... walking yeah! Walking the camera with, like, little baby steps. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that kills me. <laughs> oh man. And it's like my friend had a Dreamcast and showed me there's Guts Revenge where like now if you'd see the 90s anime and it's like this like, you know, grim dark kind of, well, it's just not fair cuz it is a dark fantasy thing. But like, uh -huh. you know, there's also now all of a sudden there's this little fairy named Puck who's in the manga and he's acting yes, all silly Puck. and you're like, "What the hell is this?" Like, I, this wasn't in the, the anime I saw, you know, and all that. <laughs> but yeah. That's um, all this. I'm gonna look through. It's a what? What the heck? You can see all the ladies that are about to spot you. Why did we focus on? It's showing you something important. Okay, it's showing me the route I want to take, which is down yeah, up to the, the mountain. The way to go, the best way to go. All right. So. The first objective, even. 
I have to get to that. La it's like right in the middle of an open field. Well, fortunately, mm -hmm. there's boxes all around and such. But and fortunately, still. you can uh, shoot these ladies in the damn head. Oh. Yeah. Well, all right, then. I guess that's what we'll do. Um, Not <laughs> not the answer I expected, uh, we'll but, do, you know. We'll, we'll I guess we're going to murder some ladies. All right, then. Well, you know. Speaking of Silent Hill 2, okay, um, doo -doo -doo -doo. where did that go? That was a, that was probably downstairs, if I had to guess. Mm -hmm. Here. Okay. And the other thing I know about Berserk is those weird stones that have face faces on them the and they scream. Bailets, yeah, <laughs> they're creepy. Um, but yeah, I didn't. I don't so, think these ladies can see you from up here, for what it's I, worth. I, yeah, I kind of figured, but um, also was a little worried about finding out, testing that theory. Oh, hey, there's. Oh, uh, whatever. Um, because yeah, there's that's the thing is that the '90s anime, unfortunately, was the one I saw. Like, so I don't, there's just a lot I've missed. So it's like bail it. I'm like, yeah, they're creepy. What do they do? Arr. You know. Whatever. Uh, I'm also aware of the extremely funny video of um, <laughs> uh, guts is like sitting under a starlit sky, and there's this really great like kind of echoey like yeah yeah yo yo playing oh, that and he's song, like yeah. looking wistfully up into the sky and the camera pans up and it's like panning up his sword and someone edited it so the sword just like keeps going <laughs> <laughs> it just keeps going and the song keeps looping <laughs> <laughs> it's so good Sloby, what did i just say you gotta shoot bitches in the head i wanted to do hard mode and not oh they well at here. least good. they show mercy and throw you halfway out yeah, well, I mean, it took me all day. Even they're like, all right, you worked hard. You earned this. <laughs> all right, you <laughs> schmuck. All right. <laughs> don't just, <laughs> Now you, you get out of here. We'll trust you. <laughs> all right. There is a mask that you can find that makes this part absolutely trivially stupidly easy. Hmm. I don't suppose it's a bunny mask. No, it's not. All right, this is this is like European extreme version. Yeah. yeah, doing it as a Zora, absolutely. <laughs> oh wait, here. Okay, there we go. Dun 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 dun. Dun dun dun. That's the song that plays when you do that, right? <laughs> I I think so. <laughs> fun moment. Here. Uh. <laughs> fun moment when we were at the Epic Campus. Oh! My dude. Right. It was right. I was like, if I could just make it. My friend, are you forgetting that you have a bow and arrow? Uh, yeah. My dude. Ooh. Does like that count them. as the inattentive jar? Forgetting you have a bow and arrow and it's I, equipped? It wasn't that. I just, uh, <laughs> I don't know. I was like, I'll count it if you want. But uh, I have a possible, okay. actually, I have an idea for making it. Well, I don't know. Okay. It's a little tiny bit risky. We could also give gift subs to someone else, some random person who has not a lot of viewers who is playing a Zelda game. Mm -hmm. The I, only I want, mon I want mm -hmm. money. Right, you got it then. <laughs> for my for my pain and suffering, so beef. It's fair. You've earned it. <laughs> God, damn it. Because you know what the other issue with that too is you're like it could then you could find you could do that then find out the person's like a total jerk. Oh yeah, fact, absolutely. It's, it's like, dangerous. Yeah, so it's like you know. And I and I'm not streaming like at all anymore so i wouldn't mind a couple subs <laughs> that's fine you got it um but yeah if this ends up being frustrating to mm -hmm. you or to the folks at home i can mm -hmm. tell you where to get the stone mask whoa the Was stone mask a statue? Uh, the stone mask makes you look as boring as a stone so um people just don't notice you it makes you effectively <laughs> invisible and therefore it completely chumps this whole area. Hey, Link. Uh-oh. Uh, uh, Link, 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 come on. What Get up! Damn it! Uh, why? What happened? I'm sorry, what occurred there? Lag? What was that? No, like, he couldn't get close Whoa. enough to the ladder. It was like, oh, oh shit! Oh my god! I guess that was Link's fault too, and not Sloby's fault. <laughs> Well, that, that, you know, oh, I'll say was like 50, it was like 50% Link. Honey. All right. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Right, Sweetie we'll, pie. We'll, we'll, we'll speed run this. Hold on a sec here. I, I'm, I'm getting a, a beverage. I'll be, I'll be right back. All right. I guess I'm going to look at chats. So I don't spoil things. Okay, chat. Okay, okay, okay. Be good, chat. Be good. Be good. Oh, brother. 
I mean, let's be honest here. That was like 80% Link's fault, really. Come on. Come on. Oh, very right. Let's see. Um, I don't think I had to do a whole lot to get there, did I? Let's see. Um, oops. <laughs> Boring as the stone, it turns Link into a slow beef stream while wrecked. Well, you're right. Um, I will tell you all for some reason, and I've never figured this out or unpacked that there's nothing to unpack. Um, there, uh, you know, Basuzo in Berserk. I always kind of like Basuzo. I don't know why. Like, just, I don't know if it's like the armor or what, but like, he just made me laugh. He was always like a funny kind of character. I mean, he's like nothing in the, in the, the whole, you know, story or whatever, but like, I don't know. Just one of those characters that made me laugh. Um, Say and die hard. <laughs> that is a spoiler. All right, let's see here. Uh, Basuzo, yeah. So Basuzo is the guy when Guts is younger, who like kind of like comes in and is like, um, uh, what do you call it? He's like a, he's like, he's got like a big. He was like a fat guy in armor, you know. So, uh, there we go. the ladder can be finicky. Well, thank you. Jesus, the barrel guy? Is he the barrel guy? I forget, honestly. But whoa, 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 whoa. he could be the barrel guy. Basuzo, yeah. Yeah, it's a fun name to say. He's like, he's very round. He's just like a very nice guy, but then, you know, obviously Guts like fucking eviscerates him with this giant slab of metal. Couldn't even call it a sword. I do like to think too, there's some dickhead who's like, you call that thing a sword? It's just like a big fucking hug of metal. So Guts is like, all right, shut up. You know? Let's see here. Wow, so it has been two in-game hours since we have attempted our stealth mission. But seriously, so Ronnie, right? She'd have to like jerk you off with one hand, cup your balls with the other. And then, you know, whether it's like prostate stuff or, you know, tip work, up to you. So, um, you know, that's gamer's choice. And then, uh, there we go. There, there, there it is. Okay, I see. I didn't think I'd walk back into Ronnie talk. Yep. So, or, you know what I was thinking is fourth hand is hold up the selfie and saying, don't mind me. Just wanking off the inventor of Let's Play. Anyhow, um... Hello? I'm back. Hey, what's up? So anyway, uh... <laughs> Were you talking about your girlfriend, Ronnie? I, I'm okay with... I'm lukewarm on her, truthfully. But, uh... <laughs> that's unfortunately the second time I've brought that up, too, on stream. The other time being in Patrick's Power Box, but, you know. Uh, I'm, I'm, I'm used to... Mm-hmm. You know, yeah. this kind of talk is yeah. on Giant Bob now. <laughs> this, oh, is that? I was gonna say, is Chip talk a lot about like the game characters wanking me? No, I'm I mean, it, I that's completely within the realm of normal conversation for me yeah. now. That's Work fair. conversation. Yeah. That's no true. getting HR involved. I've been waiting for oh, you. Oh man. Where's the eggs? Oh, do I have to use the the beehive thing to get them out of there? So Look at that nice in. couch. This is a normal couch in this lair. That's true. <laughs> well, pirates, I mean. They must have brought it on their ship. Have you seen um, Our Flag Means Death, by the way? Mm -mm. Her name's Avail? Um, it's a really good show. Let's see here. I've heard good things. Yeah, I'd recommend. Randy for Ronnie. Silence. Also, as a young bisexual, I was like, these Gerudos are really neat. <laughs> I, don't, I don't know why. I just I, love them. 
No, I'm with you on that. Gerudos they're are so awesome. Ne they're so neat. So before we do, here now, go find the other three eggs before Sea Snake gets them. Mm -hmm. Wait. So where are eggs? The only clue we have about that dragon cloud. Over the I feel bay. like that was mistranslated. Dragon cloud? It's just like a fucked up storm over the bay. <laughs> what that strange masked one says is true. Man, fucking Skull King gets around. Serious. That temple in the dragon cloud living the good life. With a, with, with a very rich hook shot is what I like to think they're talking about, but it's <laughs> it's made of solid platinum. <laughs> Alright. So I hope you like bees, ladies. <laughs> I don't even I don't, Ladies, check these bees. I'm, I'm tempted to take away another swear jar because you paid heckin' attention to that bee. And I was worried, is he gonna really pay attention to this bee or is he gonna be like, ah, a bee, what's, ha what's over here? <laughs> well, the one thing that now I'm missing though is like, okay, great, but now how do I actually get in there to, you know? Mm -hmm. Well, yeah, so that would be, I mean, like, uh, take into mind, like, what door you're leaving from, and what would a door be from here? Right, yeah. That would enter into that room. There it is. You're right. <laughs> there we go. Now, hopefully I don't have to stealth in here, because I just used a bunch of bees, and that Absolutely. would, like, be totally... I don't even know if it's possible to do this without being them. I would imagine, no, I mean, they show you the bees. They're pretty, you know. What, can you do a no bee percent? Oh! I thought it was going to be oh! Zora eggs, but now that's the... All right. Check that shit out. It's better than eggs. It is better than eggs. Fuck these and Zora. I love eggs. I'm, I got what I came for. And time is on my side. All right, fine. What's, and there's an, oh, what the H? What are you? What are you? What's your story? The oyster? <laughs> yeah. Those know. guys are also in Ocarina of Time. <laughs> right over the right over the tank. Good yeah, good plan. Let's just, let's, just, <laughs> let's just get it going. Oh, you know what? Here, I'll suck. Here. And right then, over that tank. <laughs> it's, we'll do fine. Let's get, you know what? Here. Let's, excuse me, sir. <laughs> um, so, um... Hmm. Oh, you know what? Yeah. yeah. We don't even need to... Okay. <laughs> Oh. It'd be so funny if that destroys the egg. Oh my god! I was hoping it would grab onto it. You know that. I Imagine think it's be... like a little caviar, and you just like fuck, destroy it. It's like, oh, we're we're going back in time now. Jeez, you know. Oh, I have to be. Who am I kidding? All right. Who uh, am I kidding? Who am I kidding here? I can't swim as this boy. We get clammed. This little boy body can't get into the deep end. Come on now. <laughs> the deep end is for big boys. What about, um, what's that show? I think you should leave on Netflix. Have you seen that? I've seen Good. bits of it. Yeah, that's a really good I don't show. watch a lot of comedy shows, oddly. That's, yeah. It's because, like, a lot of people have bad taste in comedy, so I'm just like, eh, I don't know what's good and what's, like, just hype. That, I think, I, I laughed so hard. At, but, uh, I was at, I was at, um, MAGFest with some folks, and they put it on, and it was like, this is really mm -hmm, stuff. Mm -hmm. So I would, I would, I would recommend it personally. Whoa, hey, get out of here. So you also have a shield, by the way. Oh, yeah, I forgot that you can that totally do. use underwater yeah. to protect yourself from evil clams. Oops, okay, no. Oh, wait, what the? Ooh, oh, shoot that. That's your magic that. shield. Don't, don't That's a shell blade. Aim for anything that's looking inside the shell. Got it. Thank you for the little raid, Fae Biotics. Hey, thanks, Fabe by Alex. Oh, I should lower chat again. Please. There we are. Man, if you got killed by that clam, that would be so damn funny. That would be pretty good. Isn't this a Zora egg? I wonder how we can carry it. Well, wonder well, no further. In our princess delivery device. You got an egg! You better have someone examine it quick. Wait, now, they said they had four, though, right? 
Okay. They have four. And you have three bottles, so you're not going to be able to do this in one run. Oh, brother. Okay. And there's three more somewhere else, so we're not going to be able to do this in one stream. But <laughs> still, you have a hook shot. And good news. Now that you have a hook shot, I have mm -hmm. a place I want you to go that'll get you a fourth bottle anyway. <gasps> and then on the, on the, on the, when we come back to this, mm -hmm. on day one, you can just get all these motherfucking eggs into this fortress. Whoa. I was, maybe it'll help me zip. Th oh, Ooh, look at this. There's a lot hey, of stuff going on here. Hey. Oh, and I noticed one earlier that I was like, yes. I wonder what that, that is. That's is a shortcut to get in. Yeah. Oh, so, okay. So now we don't actually even have to do a lot of the stealth stuff, really, because we can just zip around. Mm -hmm. like, like, what's up, danger? Yeah, it's not as long as the long shot, which I don't remember if you get in this game now that I think about it. Let's look that up, actually. I'll find it out. By the way, that chat was a reference to Enter the Spider-Verse, which if you have not seen, that's like a you drop everything uh, and go watch that right now. It, it, it actually is. Like, I don't yeah. like super, I don't like Marvel movies at all. That is like yeah. the only good Marvel movie. <laughs> I, you know, I, I, I do like them, but like, that's like when I, I, my brother's like, oh, you like those, like, you like, like top 10 Marvel movies. I'm like top 10 movies. You know what I mean? Like forget. Yeah. Like it's, it's amazing. Good. Like enter the spider verse is like a, and also like top 10 animated movies of like right. recent years. Like very, 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 very good. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah. I watched it alone in a hotel room. Cause yeah, like my, um, I was on a business trip and like, you know, I was just like watching it on my phone of all places and just like enraptured oh, by myself. Watching just it like, on your oh my phone. God, that's such I a, know. that's such a disservice to the animation. Watching I know it, it is. TV. Oh, yeah. <laughs> then I had to watch it again. Yeah. On, like, yeah, but, yeah. Like, you know. Watch it with your kid. Yeah. I, I try. It's, it's pretty age appropriate. Like there's nothing too crazy in that. That's no, like, I don't think so. Yeah. Violent I, um, or cursey or anything like that. Nah, it's fine. I mean, How do you feel about, you know, you're a dad. How do you feel about cussing? When I mean, uh, when when is your kid allowed to say shit? <laughs> shit. Well, they already do, but no. Um, when are they allowed to? I told you that story. Yeah, my son yeah. in the ph the pharmacy, he said it, but you know. Oh, uh, shit. But uh, no. What miles for else? I fuck. No. Um. <laughs> no. Uh. Uh. I don't know. Actually, you know. I guess like. 13 is the number like, that I'm gravitating, gravitating towards, but there's like yeah. a lot of stuff that you like happens on the fly when you're parenting that you don't expect and things like, you know what I mean? Just mm -hmm, like, mm -hmm. like my daughter working out shit in like the sand, like in like a Christmas movie where she's like, wait, why is Santa not doing that? And you're like, uh, oh, I gotta go. go. <laughs> <laughs> you don't want to oh, ask no, me about where babies oh, come no, the from. the TV's or... broken. <laughs> <laughs> you know? Oh no. Something easy. I should, all right, I should, let me get out of here, right? Cause there's no point in me being here if we're not going to get all the eggs on one stream anyway. Yeah, I think I think it's best to ladies warp on, warp on out. throw me out. Top ten Thank parenting you. moments go. <laughs> Thank you, Bolowski. Top ten parenting moments go. I need no. these bouncers to throw me out. Because. These li beautiful lady bouncers. <laughs> this is this is a fetish for sure. Uh, the someone, bouncer. I mean someone out there. <laughs> the <bou> <laughs> hey. I know nothing I about was... the bouncer except what I learned on the Kingdom Hearts. Uh, summary stream where Jan, instead of explaining Kingdom Hearts, explains some of the bouncer. <laughs> uh, and also I'm, that the title screen goes, the bouncer. It does. I remember that very... That's the only thing I remember about the bouncer. I rented it. I was like, this is... It was the end of the era where Square could do no wrong, you know? Where it was like, it's like, fuck it, we're making a schmuck called Einhander, and it's like, oh my god, this is amazing! I thought you just did RPGs, you know? And... And like Brave Fencer Musashi, and it's like ah, you do action stuff pretty good too. You know, although I never finished that. But whatever. Um, I have a feeling you'd like that if you haven't played Brave Fencer Musashi. But I I've seen a little bit of it. We actually mm -hmm. streamed a little chunk of it, and I was like thrilled by it, honestly. But we never like got back around to streaming it. But it's been on like on our little dream list of things that we need to get back to, along with like fucking seven other things on it. I, you know this. This is a, a weird um, a confession, but I actually physically have that list somewhere of like oh. of games like I'm meaning to get back to. Like so, right. like somebody made it for streaming purposes, like I googled up, but I have like my own list, which is right, like, right, right. This was on there actually, because then I tweeted like, which one should I do next, and that's what led to this. Oh, I see. Yeah. Cool, cool. So I don't think I've told you where to go to get you this. You did not. But you may as well, uh, for practice's sake. Uh, bring this egg to where it needs to go. Oh yeah, you're right. <laughs> Shit. You like jumped right in. <laughs> I know. 
that was a total Wee. like lack of muscle memory. That was a total muscle memory <laughs> short circuit where it's like you want to hit the other button, don't you? It's like no, you don't. Ah, yeah. Stare into the abyss. <laughs> Indeed. These guys scared the friggin' shit out of me when I was a kid. Yeah, I know. They're terrible. But, They're uh, like what? Are they like likes? I forget. They are but, like likes. Yeah. yeah. And I don't think they steal your shit when you're in Zora mode because your shields and your swords are part of your body. But I think if you're, you know, regular Link, it will steal your stuff, mm -hmm. your shield and yada yada. I'm not 100% sure, but I wouldn't see why they change it between Ocarina and this. Well, it, yeah, because in the original, like the the in Zelda one, they like they would steal your sh big shield and release you with a little shield. And you have to go buy it again. It was a big pain. Uh huh. And they looked like a big like thing of pancakes. Like they looked like a stack of really sloppy syrupy pancakes. You know, <laughs> just like going around. They're much cuter. And then you see, it. but they always scared me because of the shield thing. So I'm like, oh my god. Yeah, I yeah, yeah. Shield. I need that. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Let's see. I don't think they were in. Maybe they were in Link to the Past. I forget. Whatever. But. Uh, what was I doing? I'm um, here. You. What about the eggs? I heard they're total seven. Put them in that aquarium. Okay, okay, okay. Buddy, pal, jeez. So, fun fact. Uh, mm -hmm. There is a second aquarium here if you look across the room. And it's got a and fish got in it, nasty, right? It's got nasty carnivorous fish in it. And the I game completely allows you to put oh. it in the wrong tank. And we got to babies right eggs. we got to right that's you like gotta. yeah we got to i'm sorry you got to try to you got one egg you got to try to leave <laughs> yeah i mean we got to folks i'm sorry i'm sorry put the stream it's on 100%, does percent does the dog 100 die run. exactly so, so it's very finicky because of the bars they all have like hit boxes so oh, you have brother. to just like do it you know in different positions until he dunks it in i'm also gonna say if there is no retro achievement for this then this is a garbage achievement set right because <laughs> like that's like that's like and and you could name the achievement you monster or something like that yeah you know? right like not like or something baby. really edgy like abortion or pro-life uh, i was about to say like i hope you know i'll give them like a, a brownie point in? this game really doesn't want you to do it here i'm not full of shit, right chat you can do this chat am i full of shit? maybe it doesn't let you do it with the first egg because i don't know no you, this has to be a thing, right? Come on. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Where's your swear jar for wrong information? All right. The, the misremembering. Maybe, yeah. Location and uses. Da -da 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 -da. That's, sorry, that's clearly off there. Well, maybe. It's possible it... to sell these eggs to the curiosity shop. <laughs> that's pretty funny. Oh, that's pretty, yeah. What Maybe is, I'm full of fucking garbage. What does chat say? God, this is this, I know Maybe you can put Link? Maybe as Link. Okay. You can feed him to regu a regular fish. Hmm. Uh, sell the eggs. Never heard of feeding him to the... I swear to God. Oh my God. Maybe... Hmm. Yeah, maybe it doesn't do that. Wow, this game is not as brave as I remembered it being. Selling the eggs <laughs> is also terrible. That sounds like... That sounds, you know... That's like one of those, like participation trophy kind of things like that would also What's be really terrible sad. to sell the eggs you know but <laughs> for what it's worth that would also be bad it's uh, what's really goofy is that the eggs don't sell for very much at all they sell for 20 rupees <laughs> wow to be fair actually um is the egg already dead is that what now okay right, no okay. no no yeah <laughs> Maybe it was a schoolyard rumor. <laughs> because you know what, too? Because the guy's standing right there, and it's like there's a lot of like room for dark comedy here. Like, no, the other aquarium by the other me. Other aquarium. What you insane is the child. with you? Uh, you. Maybe I'm. Maybe I am just remembering that you can feed them regular fish. Welp. Um. <laughs> Sorry. Right. No, you're good. You, you can take away a swear, a, a, a miss, an inattention. It's fine. It's fine. <laughs> For my sins. It's fine. Um, but yeah, sorry, if you want another son. bottle, I got yeah. the, I got the hookup. Tell me the tell me the hookup. Where's the bottle? Where the so, bottle? So, do you remember going to the end, the far end of this beach, and there was like a waterfall and stuff, and like a like like on the way or two? Let's just say yes. There's there's hookshotable stuff up there. Is that in the little cave, like on the beach? 
Like, uh, no. Away with well, well this beach, yes. Yes, you go through it to the rest of the beach. Okay. I thought you were talking about some other, like... No, this, this guy, right? Like, if I go here... It's <laughs> wow, like... you stood up real funny with a single frame of animation. Yeah, Ooh. go to the right, through the cave. Where are you, where are you going? Durox tech tight sleevers, too. I thought, isn't the cave here on the map? Like, this, like, thing over here? Or is that just the house or something? Oh, I was looking at the map, sorry. <laughs> There's what a hole here. Yeah, I didn't know is. about that. What's in the... That's I fun. Know. I don't think I ever went behind this house. Oh, the usual. What if you there was like a full catch a fish here and, and, and feed it to that fish. I mean, we could. Go full circle. But... <laughs> oh, that's jerky. It's, where's, uh, here. Fishy, fishy, fishy. Use it with C. Well. Got a hmm. snack for later. What if we dump it into the aquarium with the Fedora egg and do it the uh, backwards? Or is that what you meant? <laughs> okay. Yeah, I have no idea what happens. You know, so, you know, another game I'm known for, for whatever reason, is, like, that weird Dark Seed game, and there's this infamous thing where a character's head explodes, which mm -hmm. everyone remembers also from the first game, because the main character's head allegedly explodes, which I remember, too, except I cannot find anywhere on Google how to do it or any footage of it actually happening. What? But the second game must seems like it's a very clear reference to it, you know what I mean? But, like... Mm. It's one of those things that, like, it, it tortures me. No, it's like I can't figure it out for the life of me. It tortures me. You know? me. <laughs> tortures me, no. My holy grail of, of internet mysteries. Like, weird video game things. It's like one of those things where it's like it's not a popular enough game that anyone can confirm or whatever with it, but, mm. you know. Um, is, is it this way? Where no. We were? Follow no. the beach. Follow the beach. Sorry, okay. Yeah. I think, yeah, yeah. Follow the beach. Okay. Just out of reach. Follow. That's what he's saying, actually, when he when he's singing, when he picks up something from the chest. Follow the, Follow the beach. beach. There's a lot more like likes here at night. Jeez. Yes, well, that's when they come out. They say, you know, that's that's what Hyrulean pillion pest control is all about. Oh, the freaks come out at night. <laughs> uh, waterfall. So Ooh. look look around. How would you get up this waterfall? Oh, <laughs> wow, I know. They're really I know pushing how you I back. Get. I know how. I would swim and then like dolphin jump out of it. Is how I would do it if I were. If I were in Breath of the Wild. What the he what the heck, Link? Yeah, like that. So. <laughs> dun dun dun! I'm playing like Rules of Nature in my head now for this like awesome sweet jump I'm gonna make. Link, what the heck? I'm like holding uh, down. A fun on little the a fun little yeah. trick to make dolphin jumps easier is if you bounce off the bottom of the. Um, yeah, if you bounce off the bottom of, of the lake bed or sea bed or whatever, you'll get a better 45-degree uh, angle to do cool jumps. D just go up like normal and look around, honey. <laughs> All right. This is not part of the challenge. <laughs> Still, though, it's like... So cool. Not even close to part of a challenge. <laughs> you, 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 you go with your brothers here. We chill out. Out of that cave. Watch, that's like a, I guess that's like a freshwater fish, and I killed it. But whatever, it's fine. <laughs> what do you say, sign? Beware. Okay. Die. Eh? Oh, okay. All right. Why do we have to go right there? Like, all right. So you've already been down here and killed these guys and got a piece of heart. There's nothing down here. But like I said, I don't know, mm -hmm. two minutes earlier, how would you get up that waterfall? I get up the water. Oh, I would hook shot it. And the only reason I say that is because you asked the question and I have a hook shot. And it's like mm -hmm, when all indeed. you have is a hook shot, everything looks like a postable <laughs> thing that you can hit with it. Yeah, man. The world is your oyster and you open it with hook shots. Mm -hmm. That is a really good expression, by the way. <laughs> all right. So let's, uh, let's stand here by the, the good sign. You can do a little see up, look around, have a peep. Mm -hmm. Oh, I bet I'm on the underside of a ledge, and I could just. It's not going to be here, right? But. Ooh, hello. If you keep observing your surroundings, you might see something akin to a, like a series of increasing altitude. 
platforms. Yeah, I think I see. Even so further down, even. Oh, look! Look at all. Wow, there's one so uh, low to the uh, ground. Uh, even. Uh, <laughs> Here you go. Uh, if I were physically in the room, I'd be like, red go ahead to stare at things. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no, that's not what I was thinking would happen. That's not at all what I expected. I was waiting for it to happen. <laughs> My shield, you say. You, you say. Um, the real Majora's Mask starts here. Oh, dear. But you're going to leave your shield behind you, Psycho? Oh, I thought it was gone, gone. That's what happened in. No, in you get it back. Wow, you old school. You get it back from modern like likes if you kill them. Oh Jesus! <laughs> this one, this one in particular is. Well, I'm trying. To, I'm trying to rush it. Is why. Hold he's on. He's a. Ru he's causing a ruckus over here. I, I like. I like how you just rode off that shield. Goodbye forever. It's gonna it'll be back in three days when I reset time. I you don't know? I don't think he can rebuy it if you lose that. No way. But Oh yeah, you're right. Oop, here's your shield. <laughs> Smells bad, but it's still for heroes. <laughs> I mean it would. Uh, okay, so It would, it. absolutely. It would smell terrible. Mm-hmm. So you don't you don't think about these things in, in, in a lot of games. Like how would how would your shield smell after be swallowing and swallowed by life? Like, not good. So if um, a surface is hook shotable and in you range, you will, eye, yeah. you will see the little red reticle. Yeah, I would have thought for sure though that 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 wooden tree. Oh wait, what are you doing, Navi? Navi, uh, tattle, whatever. Um, huh. I mean, I, I would think it was clearly, you know, the. You know what I mean? Like the um, clearly the uh. The, the tree. No, well, it is a tree. You're just not close enough. Hmm. Well, if only there was that? a little little thing. Maybe you get closer. Maybe there's Come on. like a. There you go. But there is also like a big log you can stand on nearby that you were expertly avoiding. Is there? Like oh. the plague. Hmm. Well, to be not fair. Not like this pl plague. Not like this plague, though. No. Oof. So she's turning blue because of a certain reason that you completely forgotten, but it's a song that you made. Oh, the scarecrow song. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Oh, for some reason the scarecrow can show up there. I don't really. I think so at least, isn't but that, I don't really super know why because there's trees here. Isn't this the? Oh, I see what you mean. Yeah, I guess I don't know. Yeah. It's, Maybe it started as like a puzzle they were doing, and then this is like they're like, "This is too hard." You know, people are know, not. Maybe he it. gives you advice or something. I don't know. Maybe you can talk to him. I'm not sure. Like, it's been a little on. while since I played Ocar uh, Majora's Mask. Come on, Jabroni. You know, you can use the the tree, and you're like, "Why did you call me Jabroni? That's weird." You know, Jabroni, Jabroni the Scarecrow. That's his exactly, name. Exactly. Yeah. That's, that was weird. <laughs> that's an arcade pit question where it's like, that's the fake answer. Is that Scarecrow's name is Jabroni. Jabroni. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, when did we get to see you coaching me through Zelda 1? That's a good oh question. Oh, my God. Oh, God. That would be a cluster. <laughs> Whoa. There's no code. People also ask. <laughs> People have also asked me, like, oh, when are you going to coach uh, Jeff Gersman through Majora's Mask? And it's like, how about never? He would never want to do that. <laughs> <laughs> Absolutely fuck no. They want me like, target or talk, but this is... I mean, get fishy know. and talk to that man. All right, all right, let's see. Hello, sir. Zora here. Don't, don't be awkward. Introduce yourself. I'm trying. <laughs> You won't stop. Come on, Conquer. What's going on here? Conquer. Right. <laughs> <laughs> that. What the? There we go. Whoa. Whoa. What the? F uh, yeah. You never learn your lesson. Is this, is, is this an ocarina? I feel like I would have remembered him. I don't know this. I don't know this man. I've never seen this man outside of this game. Only if you can swim through all the rings. 
In under two what? minutes. Oh my god, the Nintendo time. 64 and their fucking rings. Holy crap. Time to get good, my man. 20 rings. You got it. Time oh, to get no good. so good, my man. All right. Oh my gosh, look at that. Fucking chorus. Two race. Minutes, 20 rings. Go. I don't have to race him, right? He's like, follow me. He, yeah, you just gotta go through the rings. Here, okay. Oh, you're, <laughs> all right, well. God damn, you went the wrong way. I'm sorry. It's okay, it's okay. <laughs> uh, people in the chat saying, I vaguely remember this being a motherfucker. I don't know, I think y'all need to get good. I, I love this part of the game. This is one of my favorite parts of the game. I love it. It feels so good. I feel so so smooth Ooh. and graceful. You just wanna, gotta get a feel it for it. Because he's like showing me where to go, so I don't want to like overshoot him. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Not that I should have to worry about uh -oh. Also, my friend, this is the easy part. Yeah. Yeah, this is gonna be a problem. The problem is like he kind of like bursts through. I'm not like, you know what I mean? Like I'm not expecting it. So there we go. Mm-hmm. Well, basically, no matter which way you are facing, it goes where you are holding your yeah, stick. Yeah. Yeah. Gotcha, because it's so he turns on on a dime that you don't expect him to because he isn't currently facing that direction. But if y your stick is facing that direction, he is going to about face and go. I I I think I see what you mean. Yeah. Yeah. I was doing okay at the start, but I would also like it's they really want you to go through it. That, you know what yeah, I mean? Like that's the objective, yeah, man. It's, it's a it's a real ass ring. It's got collision on it. They want you to get good at swimming, and it's like for a good reason. They want you to get good at swimming. Yeah, you're gonna want to know how to fucking swim. <laughs> so you know they they put you they put you through the motions. Taste with the beginning of the Pirate Fortress, doing a couple little non-stressful things. You get the hook shot, you come up here, and it's like, okay, now we gotta test your agility and your accuracy. I'm glad they're not charging me money, too, you know? Oh, that's thank nice God, yeah, can you imagine? It'd be terrible. Because you're going to want to have, you know, those skills in your back pocket. You can just hold, like, A while you're doing that dive oh. to continue, you know, a smooth transition to the water. You don't need to like sink because you can aim aim down during that dive, basically. And by down, I mean forward, because airplane controls. Is there a way to control your speed without just stopping? Or it seems like uh, no. No, it just it's a set speed. Yeah, because that's why like what seems to and, happen. Like, you is... can you can like stop and do a little just pause to reacquaint yeah. yourself. But I fi I find personally that that makes it. I, I get more disoriented when I do that. Yeah, no, that's that's the issue is like when you like mess up and you have to like turn around. I'm finding is like okay, that's where this all yeah. goes to crap, you know. Mm -hmm. Just gotta do it right the first time, buddy. You gotta get good. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Sorry. It's fine. No, no, no. It's fine. Mm -hmm. Listen. Mm -hmm. Sorry, I'm I'm it's joking. Fine. And also, I know you can not. take I, it, I and I love that about you. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Fuck that. This is like the old essay style of like kind of ragging on each other in a friendly way that yeah, like, a lot of then, people don't get. <laughs> and then it and then it gets kind of like weirdly unfriendly because other people don't understand boundaries and you're like, hey, dude, I don't know you that well, you know. And yeah, like, and yeah. then there's also like people that are just like a little too sensitive and I don't appreciate that you're you know, like, yeah. saying these mean things about me and like making fun of me while. I'm, no, what? I'm sorry. That's not like the intention is not to make you feel bad. It's just to be like razzing on you a little bit. I don't know. Yeah. Well, there's it, also it's a, it's a different era of uh, internet. You know, and there's also like people do they kind of like do a thing where it's like I presuppose that the joke is that like you suck at this. So it's like I'll get this maybe <laughs> on my second try. Hypothetically, we don't know yet. Mm -hmm. It's like close, but I'm going to mess up on the last one. Hey, but anyway, no, no, whatever. You, did, you did great. There nice. Cool. Hey, there you go, dude. There you go. Absolutely. That was uh, that was per well, I, he didn't see the one, but yeah, it was uh, close to perfect. That's not oh, good. That was perfect. What the oh, no. the hell is this? What? There's two. There's two of them. Bad news, buddy. There's two of them. Oh. Daggett, Daggett, and Norman. What's the other one? Empty bottle. Oh, brother. I got it. Right, we can't just hit you one. Oh, here you want to race once more against me. Yeah. This time there are 25 rings. Don't fall and behind. It's harder. It's it's harder. All right. Let's Norbit. Say. Thank you, Chad. Yeah, just hold that A button. Oh, you didn't do it. <laughs> oh. Oh, I said, I'm sorry, I didn't really. 
I thought you meant That's like okay. while you were surfacing kind of like that, but No, not. no, like while you're diving, if you just hold swim, you will do a very nice transition from the dive into a swim. You won't have to faff around with uh, you know, trying to get to the right altitude yeah. in the water. <laughs> I don't depth, that's the word. <laughs> depth yeah. is the water term for altitude. Did you know it's, that? You know, honestly though, it's plane control, so it's fine. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. We can talk yeah, about it. Yeah, you know, yeah. that's what I'm thinking about. I, I also like this because it gives you a little tiny bit of more familiarity with doing those little dolphin jumps, which, yeah. you know, you don't need to, I don't think you have to do for anything in particular. Oh, okay, that's on. shitty. That's shitty. Oh, don't on. do that oh, game. Come oh, come <laughs> on. <laughs> we'll just put that right there. You weren't looking Ooh. at anything while you were like, that was nice. You handled that. You handled that real good. That was like, yeah, that was my little like, okay, just let, let Beautiful. the gaming take over. <laughs> don't think Beautiful. too hard. I, know, no. I, I think I messed up too much at the beginning now. I'm not going to. No, no, you're doing great. If you're following him, you're doing great. If you see him, you're doing pretty good. But yeah, they're going to make you do some dolphin jumps here. Look at that. That was great. That was excellent. Thank you. But yeah, kind of getting the range of dolphin jumps figured out is nice because it'll just save you some time, like floating around. Sometimes you could just do a cool little dolphin jump up to a ledge and you'll be like, ah, I feel fucking dope. Beautiful. Nice form. Look at that form. It's all power posing. You're doing it. You're doing here it. Here we go. Here we go. Okay, you're okay. Oh, yeah. Two, two what is seconds. up? No, you got this, man. You got this. <gasps> you still got it. You still got it. Don't panic. Don't panic. Don't panic. Don't I'm panic. Not Don't panic. Panicking. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Hell yeah. The first try on the hard one. Sea legs, my boy. There we go. Yes, first try. Yes. Uh, that is an earned bottle. That, absolutely. That's a good bottle. They what underestimated you. <laughs> I clapped. <laughs> <laughs> you, JT Rolf. Now play them again for a heart piece. Is that true? Yes, that is. I think that's true, actually. Let me okay. look that up. I'll make sure that person's not lying. <laughs> uh, all right. Let's do it. Oh, they don't have names. So sad. They're just the Beaver Brothers. He's back. They go brother. unnamed in Majora's Mask. Yeah, they just don't have a name. Big Brother and Little Brother. It's bullshit. Fine. Yep, you can race again to win a piece of heart from yeah, them. My little Brother. Time limit's 150. That's yeah, the time limit is shortened. Hold whole day after, like while you're diving, even like gotcha. after you dive, etc. Just hold it the whole time. Got it. Yeah, nice. Mmm. Now you're now you're Zoraing That's in style. Yeah. Starts to feel good after a time. It's Stockholm oh. syndrome, but. <laughs> <laughs> no, totally. And he stays ahead of you no matter what, so you don't have to worry about overshooting. Yeah, him. So it's like, not yeah. like a race to beat him. It is just yeah. to get those rings. Thank yeah. God. <laughs> I was figuring though you could like accidentally overshoot him and then like kind of be like, uh oh, now you don't know what. Yeah, you're gonna have to figure out the path, pal. You know, but it <laughs> wasn't really like that. Yeah, I don't think you can. Yeah, it doesn't seem like it. Or if you can, then it's like really hard to do it. So. Ooh, oh, nice boy. recovery. Good recovery. Thank you. You're getting it. You're getting your sea legs for sure. Yeah, there we go. Very proud. I'm, I'm beaming like a proud mother <laughs> over here. <laughs> a proud mother beaver. In <laughs> That's me. Watching. <laughs> Uh, oh dear, oh dear. Okay, you're okay, you're okay, you're okay. Okay, uh. All this stuff is technically optional. You can, you know, not get this bottle and not meet these beavers and all this stuff, but, right, like, but... this is a really good. I think this is easier, like, one of the easier bottles for me, and that's because I'm just, like, so good at, like, I'm so video good games. at summer swimming. Yeah, you know, video games. just everything. Oh, um, God, my, uh, shit. Oh god, my um, t my window lost focus, so like my control oh, no! stopped working. Oh no, that's okay. You're still good. You're still good. You got this. You did so good yeah. the whole time. Like you got a plenty of leeway. Look there at we this. Go. No there fucking problem. <sighs> he did it again, little brother. Oh, that was smooth like butter. Nice, nice. Now race me. I'll race. Mm -mm -mm. Let's do it. You can do this. The moon's like, wow, this dude's swimming. Let's find out together. <laughs> Hold that button. Yeah. There we go. Yes. That is good. That is mm. good. Tasty transition to the sea. Hell yeah. Hell yeah, oh, yeah gamer. I guess this is 
probably fresh water. Oh yeah, oh yeah. It is very funny when you dolphin swim and you hit something mid majestic jump. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> I'd recommend oh. it, but not right now. <laughs> right. We'll find out. Oh dear. Yeah, I think this is one of the easier bottles to get personally, besides the ones that just kind of stumble butt first into plot wise, like uh, the one you get from uh, the witches in the mm -hmm. forest there, the, the swamp rather. Whoa. Whoa! Oh, fancy that, boy, fancy boy, that? fancy Wait, boy. I'm not doing that on purpose. I'm not doing that on we purpose. Got a, we, got, we got a fancy boy emergency over here. I uh, <laughs> that was uh, me showing off. We call that Zora Flex Skip. Uh, oh dear. Uh. Oh Excellent. That was so funny. Oh dear. Oh god. 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 That was super sexy styling Zora shit right there. Oh yeah, it's like the the, the bug-eyed look on my face on my camera though kind of belied the truth of it, but you know, like the <laughs> Someone like, clipped that. That was funny as hell. Yeah, there are certain angles that if you, you know, bump into them, you will have a very interesting needlessly like, graceful ricochet. Yeah, like the Tony Hawk uh kind of thing here. Oh dear. Ooh, ooh. That's scary. That, that tight yeah, like, turn. But... As, uh, as Ajo Gamer says in the chat. Um, oh dear. You still got it. You still got it. Don't, don't panic. You can Not. jump right through it practically. Just sink or swim. There we go. No. What? <laughs> oh, you have to... <sighs> That's annoying. I thought yeah, I thought it was just the rings. But... More practice is good. More practice is good. Yeah, it's fun. I didn't realize you also have to reach the goal because whatever. <laughs> yeah, sorry, you you do. That's fine. It's fine. <laughs> that was a technicality right there. It's that was fine. unfortunate. Yeah, if I hadn't been like, it's my own my own problem for like showing off really, you know. Uh, yeah, you know, if that really cool move didn't happen earlier, that that was hubris. Mm -hmm. Oh dear. Now comes the point of the night where I can't recreate anything I did, but all right, let's see. <laughs> it's fine. You have plenty of time to catch up. That's true. Yeah, you gotta reach the dam, I'm sorry to say. Nah, it's all right. It's okay. Oh, well. Um, but yeah, as uh, Joe Gamer was saying in the chat, the main reason I'm so hard 3DS is because I love how it works for a game. Yeah, like the way that you, the only way to swim like this in the 3DS version is to constantly be using magic. Um, and it's just not oh, fun. Oh, yeah, you mentioned that, right. It's not yeah. a fun change. Like, imagine doing this, but, like, the whole time it's, like, draining your magic meter. It's like, yo. Ugh. Yeah, that feels like something that, like, you know, somebody was like, we have to balance this because of ludonarrative dissonance. And it's like, you got to get <laughs> out of game school, pal, and, like, just learn eh. what's fun, you know, that kind of thing. But, um. Absolutely. What was I say? Yeah, like something, something balanced, but you know. Yeah, like I don't know. I was thinking about like the other, the other bottles. I think the Goron race is harder, personally. Mm -hmm. um, you had a pretty e decent time with it, though. Gotta say, um, so your mileage may vary. I find this one to be. This um, one. And like well, Romani Ranch is like <sighs> not bad, but it's just like stressful. Oh. Oh! No! oh a tragedy has struck again. It's okay, let's go. You, you got third time's the, char the charm. This is the run. We can be here all day. <laughs> but we won't because you'll do great right. this time. You know what's funny is like I have to, I'm really thirsty and I have a drink right in front of me and I can very easily pause this game and stop But it's and to do that. <laughs> but I'm not because like my thumb is glued to the A button. And again, it doesn't have to be, but you know, hey, mm -hmm. it's, it's tap it, that's just how we're doing all it. This, all this water making you thirsty. Exactly, yeah. I should tweet uh, this fancy boy emergency. Fancy boy emergency. We're having beaver problems. <laughs> oh dear, oh dear. Goodness gracious me. You got there, okay. Mm. Okay, okay. Whoa, whoa, whoa. That was almost fancy boy problems. <laughs> You know, like, there is a show called Get a Life. It was a really weird show with this guy, Chris Elliott, who was, like, a super niche comedian. And, like... Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He does, like, really... I, I, I know his face. Yeah. He does, like, really absurdist humor. And, like... But the one it's been burned into my brain because he had this one episode of the show where um, he wanted to become a model, you know? 
and like uh -huh. he went to he, like paid for like it's like a scam modeling school but they called it fancy boy modeling no handsome boy modeling academy uh -huh. and i just like love that to pieces like it's not even really legit. much of a joke but it was just great like you know legit oh, oh no, frick. that's okay you got more time you got time to get okay. through there okay. line it up there we go very nice there we go. Good control. Good remembering that it's the f direction you're currently moving the stick in for the immediate about phase. Beauteous. Now you do it a third time for 20 rupees. Okay, we did it. <laughs> Great. Let it be over. <laughs> Please let I'm it be over. <laughs> time to hydrate, man. You deserve Indeed. that. You Looking, it. staring at all this water, you deserve to hydrate. Well earned. A well earned sippy. Mm -hmm. A victory sippy. That's not a lot of water you got left in there. <laughs> no, it's not. I'm gonna have to get another one. But four um, bottles, my man. Now, do I? Uh, what do you call? It? Is this? Do you think a good time to call it, or is there more to do? Let me think. Hmm. <laughs> it depends on you. Okay. Mm -hmm. I have a suggestion, mm -hmm. but depends how much longer you want to stream because mm -hmm. it might take like a half hour 40 minutes i don't know it depends how fast things let's, go let's find out you let me take could, a mm -hmm. you could now that you have the hook shot i want to remind you that mm -hmm. that was the reason you couldn't do that first spider house nice Alrighty. um pretty sure, let me pretty sure. I'll take a shot let me uh let me just take a quick bio break i'll be right back yeah absolutely i'll entertain the chat in the meanwhile Thank ask you. me questions how you guys doing So yeah, love that Majora's mask. He did, he did good at the swimming. You know, I'm like, you know, looking at this from like, you know, it's really interesting to watch a new player play this stuff and see like how they handle things that I'm so used to, you know? And like, I'm seeing why and how the, the devs kind of forced these little different swimming sections on you to prepare you for <laughs> the temple later so that's gonna be good <laughs> xenotrope with the fucking rocky horror picture show <laughs> and i'll entertain <laughs> the cameraman with the world's biggest hand job <sighs> how do i think he'll do in the dungeon mm -mm -mm. i don't know i don't know <laughs> i don't know um, I think he'll have the biggest problem in Econa Canyon. Like, almost certainly. That's a, that's a very complicated temple, especially if he's even gonna, if he's even gonna try to do the fairies. Oh my god. I feel like Econa Canyon is, like, legit very, very hard, especially if you're trying to get those fairies. But, um, I think Great Fish, Great Fish Temple? Is that what it's called? Um, I think he'll do okay, but get kind of bamboozled by the map and the flow of water and kind of like overthink it and try to f like over figure it out. Cause I think like the, the ironically go with the flow is kind of the theme of that temple. And like, really you should just kind of let that temple happen to you and trust the game design because like you really don't miss anything that you can't undo in that temple by reversing the water flow. Um, but the fact that it's basically Instead of raising and lowering the water level like you did in time, it's reversing and unreversing the water flow throughout the temple. So I feel like it's hmm, I don't know. I don't I don't know if he'll get the uh all the fairies though. We'll find out. And Chip is good. Right. We had a nice weekend in Wisconsin. <laughs> all right. Clip under the ramp, skip the whole temple. That'd be cool. <laughs> I, uh, Hello. A, nice. Hello. I'm I'm gonna undo any gamer cred I got from that, and just let everybody in chat know that I am wearing a T-shirt my mother bought me, that says "Best Dad in the Galaxy," but the A in Dad is a Darth Vader helmet. But um, <laughs> what the fuck? That's a really <laughs> ironic shirt. He was bad. He was yeah no he was not great. <laughs> he was not what a great the hell? father. That makes no sense. <laughs> he was mostly he was absentee for most of their lives. He was and, absentee you know. and cut off his son's hand. Right, knowing it was his dad. son too. Like knowing it like, was his son, be like fuck your hand. 
Yeah, because that's I mean, dad, fuck your hand. He gets, he gets kind of a pass in the Death Star. He's like, this pilot's weird, but I, I can't place him, which is odd, but you know, whatever. And then, <laughs> uh, uh, well, it's a funny shirt. Oh my god. Yeah, it's There's a good. Got to be better dads to put as that A. <laughs> well, my mom doesn't know, you know, so hey, it's fine. It's fine. It's a hangout sleep shirt. I get it. Mm -hmm. Exactly. Yeah, threatened his daughter too. May have may have probed his daughter with that probing uh, floaty needle so, machine. Yeah. So you know, and the funny thing is, like, about Star Wars too is like, there's people who it's just like George Lucas knew it all when he was like, no, he didn't. No, he like, did you know what I mean? Fuck up. Get out of here. You're gonna alter th theory, fucking George Lucas of all people? No. No. Come on. He no. had no idea. I'm not. No. You know. Yeah. He did. He, he definitely didn't intend for. You know what I mean? Like certain. No. Absolutely, the fuck not. What was your plan there? I was rolling into him. him. I was gonna make you friends him by punching him with my. <laughs> he just rolls right into there him. There we go. Boom. Yeah, no, because there, there's a lot of like, you know, brother making out with sister stuff that you're like, you're sure you intended this stuff the whole time, you know? But there we go. Because I think it's right. Isn't it right here? The spider house. It I'm is. Like, you are okay. so right. Okay. Shit, but I need a stick, don't well well wait. What no, do you I don't have? need a stick. Oh. You have the ability to set things on fire without sticks if you turn into Nazora. Until if you turn to a boy. A boy with fire. Oh, a boy with fire arrows? Yeah. You're right. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> A boy with fire arrows. You have constant ability to make fire and rules. <laughs> Wait, I've never seen Star Wars. What the fuck? So you know, <laughs> I when they re-released the original trilogy, you know, um, I saw Empire in the theaters with someone who didn't also had never seen the original. And then when Luke and Leia make out kiss when she's trying to prove something to Han, e everybody goes like ew, and she's like, why are they saying ew? And it's like, <laughs> oh, yeah, because right. They don't know about the. Uh. Hmm. Help me! I'm not a monster. Spider's curse may be this way. I beg of you, find them all. The gold ones. Spider token. With the curse, teach them good. Hurry! Right, this is awful. All right, all right. How many of these are there? Do I need? Do I not need to know? Thirty, I believe. Thirty, oh, brother. If I'm all not right. totally mistaken. You can, uh, I think, if you go to your uh, sub screen, it'll say like zero out of thirty somewhere. I see, ah, like, a full shit. Okay. <laughs> oh, brother, put another one in the... In I'll the... put another one in the swear oh, door Oh, wait, me. do I need a... Or is that a hook shottable thing? Because I thought it was... You can find buggies throughout this temple. Okay. Okay, good. There are buggies to be found, besides the spiders. Oops. I don't, oh, man, you go fuck them up. Kill. Yeah. <laughs> let's, not, let's not even, yeah. Let's, let's not you, speak you, of that. You sought mercy instead, I see. Yeah, exactly. That was a warning shot. That was just letting him, like, tell your friends. You know, like, tell tell everyone. What the heck? Link. I let you live this day. You can also use your hook shot. That's, oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. He's got to be close. your first one. I'm, I'm so glad that Link doesn't, like, do the, like, freeze frame bullshit he used to do. Oh yeah, I forgot when about all that. When he collected Skultola tokens in the past. Oh, brother. Yep, there are 30. I hear one. Also, I have to take a bio break. Be right Go back. Go for it. All right, I'll entertain. Lucas is weird. Did you read how he wanted to imply Indiana Jones? Yes, yeah, I've talked about it. I hate that, because I used to love Indiana Jones when I was a kid. Like... He was one of my favorite heroes and stuff, and then, like, yeah, it's like, hey, uh, how about if, you know, um, what do you call it? And it's a shame, too, actually, there's a real, well, not that it has to do with it, really. There's a really funny Easter egg, apparently, in, what is it, Indiana Jones and the Infernal Machine, I think, where you can, like, become Guybrush Threepwood. It's pretty funny. Um, is bow and arrow aiming a projectile a little different? I kind of forget, truthfully, Ocarina, but it feels roughly similar maybe it's that was infernal machine i don't think i ever played that one because there's the games where it's like emperor's tomb favorite Atlantis, obviously but whatever yeah no lucas is an odd guy um you know there's like uh and there's like a whole like weird sort of renaissance of like the prequel trilogy happening where it's like it wasn't that bad and which is fine but then there's also like 
and people only dislike it because of the Plinket reviews. I'm like, no, 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 hold on now. Let's not, let's not say things too hastily, you know? But, yeah, Stephen King, I mean, Stephen King at least had, like, a really bad coke habit that he could probably blame a lot of the weird-ass shit, especially in It On, you know, where it's like, I'm, you know, I'm really sorry, folks. Like, he, like, he's on record, too. He doesn't remember writing Cujo, which, like, or I guess that must be wrong, because how could you, you know, I, I mean, how high could you be you forgot you wrote the novel, you know, which maybe the answer is pretty high. Uh, I'm with a hot take. All the Starman movies are bad. I think, I, and I think, I think they're fun. I think, like, I like the original, like, the, the New Hope, honestly, the best. Like, I get the whole, like, Empire's the best blah, blah, blah thing, but, like, um... Like, I actually do like, uh, Star Wars, the like, A New Hope, number four, like, just because it's just, it's just like a fun, self-contained movie, and we don't have to, like, do this whole, like, hmm, is it really part of this and whatever kind of thing, you know, but, um, yeah, actually, I like King's book on writing, where he writes about, well, no, you get no points for guessing. Oh, hello. Um, but, that's is way easier than this stuff. Uh... I think people only like Star Wars because they first saw it when they're 12. Yeah, I mean, I think you like Star Wars was kind of like, it's like a fun take on sci-fi in the sense that like you don't, it's like rare that it's like, sci it's like so someone described it as science fantasy, which I think was kind of a fun description of it, you know, where it's like nothing is like really too serious or anything like that, you know. Like Star Trek, Star Trek had like a lot of like in-universe explanations for all the shit that's going on and like Star Wars is just like, fuck it, let's say magic, you know. And it's like fine, it's fun, you know, whatever. But um, yeah. I never really got into Trek so much, you know. I liked some. I liked uh, Next Generation and Deep Space Nine, but I didn't finish Deep Space Nine. I should go back to that. Um, I actually saw some of Next Generation with my mom, which is funny, but like, she really liked it too. Um, I was gonna make a joke about her liking John Luke Picard because I think a lot of people thought he was really hot, but like. That said, I don't think I don't know. She was big into Kevin Co Costner. Yeah, I was talking about my uh, my mom who actually liked Star Trek: The Next Generation. Aww. Um, but like, yeah, I know. Yeah, uh, but she had a crush on Kevin Costner, not not Patrick Stewart. So back in the nineties. Kevin Costner was in Star Trek. No, no, no. I just I was like going from the one topic to the other. Um, oh, okay. <laughs> I think I guess I need a whatever to get into there, like a bug or whatever it is. But uh. So, um, no, Ke but Kevin Costner is not in Star Trek. Although, you I know, I was they gonna say, I don't remember him being in Star Trek. <laughs> the movies have, like, weird cameos. Like, Christian Slater's in one of them. I forget which one. Just out of nowhere. Like, Christian Even, Slater's. like, the show has weird cameos. Like, Iggy Pop was one of the... I forget the name of the aliens, but he was in Deep Space Nine for an episode. Oh, no shit. It's like, and it's like, holy shit, that's Iggy Pop. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> I also love seeing, like, bit actors that in like certain movies that I love disappearing and like Deep Space Nine is great for that because Jeffrey Combs is in a lot of Deep Space Nine. He plays two or three different characters in Deep Space Nine. I don't, rem I don't think I remember enough about Deep Space Nine really. Uh, I remember- He plays uh, Wayun and also uh, Brunt, who's one of the uh, Ferengi guys. Uh, and I think he played like a couple bit parts too. Oh, buggies galore. So I'm not really 100% sure. I guess, like, you use them by those, like, weird little holes, and they crawl mm -hmm. in and scare the Sculptula out, if I had to guess, you know? Exactly, is... exactly. So, yeah, there catch as many of those as you can. You're going to use them a bunch. Hey, 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 hey. Oh, there we go. Hey, 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 hey. Aw. One, let's see here. Taurus mask. What let's do I here. need to do with the um, swamp? house. I just want to make yeah. sure I'm not sending you in here like an idiot and you're supposed to have some later weapon or ability or something. That would be tragic if you get like 28 of them and it's like, well, it's the <laughs> last two. You need some weird ability. Get right. <laughs> <laughs> you need the Skulltula mask, actually. Which yeah, like some weird mask. There is like a... Uh, the later one, the one mm. that's at the ocean, you do need like... I don't, I don't think you need it, but it like helps because puzzle that you're going to want to do to get a heart piece in there that you do need a certain mask for and it's just like man <laughs> that sucks <laughs> i want to hook shot the beehive but i'm afraid of something really funny happening if i do no fucking fucking do it, do it. well yeah that's how we have it. there we go whoa no it's the right thing to do there you go 
I don't think you need anything for this besides the hook shot. Whoa! Oh dear. Okay. Oh, that was my analog stick kind of being a jerk. Okay. <laughs> Iggy Pop, the alien that couldn't act. <laughs> <laughs> hey, he existed. He's. <laughs> <laughs> That's something, yeah, you know, you can say something about it. It, hel it helps when you he play, like, up. a peculiar race that's, like, a little, like, a slightly unemotive, but, like, a little cheesy at the same time. Not as unemotive as Romulans, but... <laughs> Wasn't the, isn't that Odo guy pretty unemotive, if I remember? Whatever the shapeshifter. He's wonderfully subtle. He's not, he's not mm. unemotive. He's just very, he's very crotchety. Mm -hmm. I remember and that. he he's Sundere. Mm. Oh, is exactly well. how I would describe Odo. Is he's very Sundere feelings, absolutely, but he doesn't show yeah. them to just anybody. I should have used it when I heard the thing. Actually, this is probably a waste of a bug or three or something. But maybe. I didn't. What the heck? What does this do? <sighs> That's <so> terrible. <laughs> Congratulations! The bugs found arrows for you. <laughs> Where did I even find those bugs again? They were in grass around here, right? Hopefully that They were generates. under rocks. I mean, you're gonna find a bunch of them. Yeah, right. Like, you know, you can even go into older rooms that you already picked up a rock in. I think the rocks might respawn. Yeah, exactly, Xenotrope. When Odo lets his guard down, it's like, oh my God, we're having a moment, you know? I mean, every single Star Trek has their Pinocchio character and Odo is that for Deep Space Nine. Pinocchio character? Yeah, absolutely. Like, you know, Data was the the robot that wanted to be a real boy. Mm -hmm. In um, oh, Pinocchio. I see what you mean. I thought Pinocchio you meant like character. lying or something. No, no, like, like, like they want to like, they want to be a real boy or <laughs> experience that they can't have, you know, and they kind of struggle with that because they're just not predisposed to having that you know, happen to them because of their situation or their, their alien race or something. But yeah, like you have Spock, the Vulcan, he doesn't get humans, but he's like trying to get it, you know, and then you've got uh, Data, robot who wants to be a real boy. You've got Odo, who, you know, is this fish out of water changeling who doesn't have human relationship and stuff like that. So he has that to learn. And uh, Seven of Nine later on. And I don't know how, who else is <laughs> After that. <laughs> Seven of nine. Who's really hot and doesn't understand why. Deal is. I don't think this will work, but it's the song of awakening. The Deku scrubs asleep. Oh, wow. Well, okay. Yeah. Hey. I was like, that seems way too obvious. Look but... at you. Look at you. Wow. That's what I call a puzzle solver. There we go. What did you get out of here, you? That's ridiculous. Wait, that looks like you can walk through it also, but... You can, uh... Yeah, one thing you can do something to it. I could burn you can it. You get up in there. Let's see. Um... Ba -da -ba -da -ba -da -da. Do -do -do. It was a good call. Sometimes doing things works. Like, you have a lot of good instincts. Mm. And I, I feel like, um... More often than not, you're overthinking something. And that's mm. very common. Like, even from, you know, again, I'm bringing up the fucking escape room situation. But mm -hmm. I saw it happen all the time. People would think of a way more complicated answer to something that was just, like, right in front of them. Like, hey, did you try opening that door? <laughs> <laughs> it opens. It's not locked or something, you know. <laughs> did you try using that key? You found a key. Why don't you use it somewhere? I mean, for something, you know. <laughs> yeah, this is a very charming part of human psychology where it's just like, I'm going to complicate this for some reason. <laughs> <laughs> I can't help but make it harder than it is. Whoops. Whoops. <laughs> What's really sad, though, is when, like, somebody struggles with something like that so long, and then mm -hmm. they finally do the very easy thing. They're the biggest idiot in the world, and I feel so bad. <laughs> <laughs> Which is why I was probably, yeah, I, w I was one of the more game masters, because I would see people almost do a thing, or... They would say out loud, like, I bet it's this. No, it can't be that. And then they wouldn't do it. Yeah. Like, I would chime in and, and like, like five minutes later, if they didn't do the thing, and instead of saying, you should do this, what you say is, like, I heard somebody had a really good idea earlier and didn't do the idea they had, but it was such a good idea. <laughs> and, then they, and then they feel really smart, like they earned it and not dumb. Like, why didn't I do the 
<laughs> Do they ever forget the thing, though? Oh, all the time. Yeah. And I have to, have to remind them, like, no, no, five minutes ago, you were talking to your friend, and he was holding that thing over there. And you said something really smart about... And if, like, if it's not chiming a bell at that point, mm. like, then you give a little more detail about the nature of the thing that they were talking about, and that it was totally the right idea. And, like, go with your first instinct. And then if they still don't get it, I'll be like, oh, do you want me to just, like, tell you the thing you said? It was really smart. And then they'll be like, yeah, what did I say? And then I'll tell them the thing that they said that was really smart. And they'll be like, I told you! And they'll smack their friend that they told them so. <laughs> the most satisfying way to give a hint. <laughs> Instead of like, you're the dumbass that had an idea and didn't do it. It's like, you're the secret genius that had an idea but doubted yourself. But it was so right! <laughs> Wait, I hear, I hear one. I was here before, but I hear it. Was there it's still the some scritchy side. scratchies in the previous room? Oh, maybe it was in the previous room. There was in the previous room, yeah. I think you can get them scritchy scratchies. I think you're right. I think it has to do with that place I was in, too. I think I could have... Whoa, that was weird. Oh. Oh, huh, what you got, you got yourself a little gem rolled. <laughs> What gives the, those pots? You just walk across the top of them and they're like, here, have an open. Oh, hey, stupid. That's analog. Hi. <laughs> there is my... something sus about those pots. Like, those are weird. Ooh, hey. I just saw some beehives, too. Ow. Uh oh. <laughs> what if I was. There's no way, right? No. What? Yeah, Nintendo's good about not being trapped. Like, like, letting you just be trapped forever, you know? Oh, God. That'd be terrible. It really would. Um, I bet, I bet there's something in one of these, right? They're gonna make, mm -hmm. and that's gonna be the last one I do, because that's always the way I think go. Oh, or not? Okay. okay, there you go, second one. Wow, they're so bouncy. <laughs> they are. That's kind of horrible, truthfully. Uh, let's see here. Oh dear. Oh, just bees. <laughs> Bees that are approaching. It's fine. They're fine. We've got bees. We've got bees, but it's fine. We'll be a, a decky scrub and they won't bother us at some point, right? So, 16 of these. There's really 30? My god. They really You're nuts halfway there, living on a prayer. Oh dear. Man. This is going so much better than dog racing, I gotta tell you. Yeah, 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 for sure. This bee is tiny bee. <laughs> Deku versus B. Who will reign supreme? This is like Heaven battle. or hell? This is like a this is a, a Beyblade kind of thing happening right now. <laughs> a go. beautiful dance of nature. Behold, the Deku scrub as it defends its 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 den. There's this really good PlayStation Beyblade game, and I mean really good because it's really funny because they they like did not even bother finishing the translation, and Z like one of the. Target. I'm sorry. <laughs> okay, there you go. Yeah. I was gonna say Z target him. <laughs> the, and the one like the one thing like the announcer keeps saying is well like over and over again just the word well and that's like literally it and it's like well. really weird. He's like what a great launch well 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 what and it's like. <laughs> It's even like the dialogue box is there too, so it's well, like not even a weird voice box. It's, well, it's yeah. pretty weird. It's Konami. They they that was like when they were starting to really oh. phone mm. in. Oh yeah, it's on yeah. Classics of Game. Right? Classics of Game 001. Mm-hmm. The first one. Classics of Game is very good thing. I've been but, mean uh, to ask. I'm pretty sure Sebmul runs that, right? Is that true? That I've, I had I've no got idea. A theory. I've got a game theory that Sebmul runs that. I'm being to ask him. Oh my gosh, that 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 kind of tracks. Wouldn't that, that could, make sense? I think it's him. That's, this is my game theory. I think he runs that. <laughs> that's a that's like a better game theory than most too. Oh, I think it's All right, here's the deal. Um, wow, we gotta be able what to you get grab in there. on the side of that non-Euclidean fucking curved surface? There we go. So I want to tell you about these pots. You can interact with them in a way that you have not yet tried to interact. I can't believe it was that simple either, just slashing. Yeah, yeah, just thing. slice that thing. Yeah, absolutely. It's something on the on the line of that. You can do that with those pots. Something That's akin it. to that. Is it becoming a Goron and smashing him is my <laughs> question, because I think Goron smash is quite honestly the solution. 
Not quite. Maybe try the other ones? Wait, did that move? No, maybe not. Or, wait. Did that move? No, it did not move. Come on. Yeah, it didn't move. <laughs> oh, hello. What the heck? <laughs> A creative way to murder a Skultola. I'm down. I'm still here. Are, are they all dead? Or there, I think there's another one in one of these pots. Uh, this is like when like you run out of ideas for the Easter egg hunt, and it's just like, all right, you know. <laughs> I think I think you can run into them as a child mm. and just like run into them like you run into crates. I see. It's weird because it took like a few of them, but all right. That was weird. It's like it wasn't connecting correctly. Oh, silence! 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 Hmm. One of all these right. three rooms is 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 Gold to Lafray. Nice. There we go. And open. Beautiful silence, yeah, I, think. I think. All right, all right. Are there, come is it along, possible there's only 20 of them, or? There's, there's only, no, no, there's 30. So mm. there is uh, only 11 left. I don't hear any. Uh, do, I yeah, I think this room is or? clear. There's a bunch of other rooms that you haven't yeah. been to. And also, there's definitely another guy somewhere in this room that has not been found yet. I'm very relieved that there is a sound cue for it, but that's not kind to the hard of hearing, obviously. Mm -hmm. Would not fly in a modern game, but uh, I, uh, as an able-bodied person, I, I quite like a, so a good sound cue here and there. Mm -hmm. Did I ever tell you about the, the LP that talked about that? Sanitarium, did I you ever talk about this? I think we might have. But... Um, I don't know. I love say I've played Sanitarium. I love Sanitarium. What was the discourse with that? There was a really good screenshot. Let's play of it back in the day, where that one of the devs who worked on it chimed in after every chapter and talked oh. about like the development of it. Really, I so, love that. So you know, you know how the game works and everything. So the the way they came up with it was all. It was a small dev shop. They all wanted to do like a different kind of game, and they couldn't decide. So they came up with Sanitarium, where excellent, all the excellent. characters are the game that they want to make. That makes total sense. Oh my god, mm -hmm. that absolutely makes sense. And um, sure, fucking why not? <laughs> there is a sound puzzle. It, in it, it. does. F mm -hmm. It does feel like an anthology in a way, doesn't right? it? Right. Yeah. Yeah. The Sanitarium the was neater than I thought it would be. It was definitely, yeah. I, I, I really like that Let's Play. Because that was a game I saw when I was younger and I just never got, you know? Like, I saw that in, like, Harvester in the store, but I never actually, like, played them or anything. <laughs> oh, um, you haven't played... Have you played Harvester? I never played it, no. I've watched <gasps> a lot of it, but... Oh, man. I love that fucking piece of shit. <laughs> no, it's... Yeah, it's really... There's, like... I was, um... I think I was on a Hardcore Gaming 101's podcast about, like, hmm. where we rank the games and, like, they, um... Uh, I feel like we had some, like, debate or discourse around like if, if it's like intentional like where they were trying to make art or are they trying to kind of be like schlocky oh, har harvester yeah absolutely oh my god i like, feel like mm -hmm. it was made by immature guys that had a point and didn't quite know how to make the point but were very opinionated right um that's my very 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 generic you know, breakdown of that game. <laughs> yeah, like, I feel like it but plays it, around. Oh, yeah. it does have it does have really, really, you know, correct for the most part, you know, things that it's saying via its satire. I think like it is basically, you know, this comes from the. I mean, this is a whole like eighty percent written, but it's not like cohesive enough to to make yet. Um, because I just love Harvester that much. <laughs> um. But, like, this comes on the heels of the 1992, three hearings about Mortal Kombat and violent mm. games and Night Trap Night and that trap. sort of stuff. And, like, the Konami Enforcer, that little goofy blue plastic uh -huh. gun. I had that. Yeah, mm. you know, uh, that was a whole situation. And, you know, it was a pretty direct response to those that whole situation legislation wise 
Um, but the problem is, is that, you know, games take about two, three years to make. So by the time the game came out, right. it was old news and no one gave a shit. And, you know, that still exists. Night Traps, just that it's the games and says like, hey, you know, game is not for kids, like baby kids under a certain age, which absolutely makes sense. That's how, you know, movies were, you know, it, sh it should have had this movie style rating the whole time. Duh. Um, and that was a pretty fair compromise, all things considered, right? Mm -hmm. um, also, someone says I'm cutting out. Am I like, do I sound weird on your end? You did for like a minute there when you were talking. Like, I caught the oh. gist of what you were saying. So, okay. like, you're Sorry. back to normal now. No, no, you're fine. I think it was just, I think it's a Discord being a jerk. Yeah. You know, but... Whoops. Sorry. I could, like, leave and come back again, though. If you like. Maybe I will. BRB. Got it. Anyway, <laughs> mm -hmm. I feel like the thing too, like Harvester, like the 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 lodge undercuts a lot of it because that feels very just random in a way where like yeah, it's kind of like the lodge really felt like here's where we couldn't, sh you know, this is all the ideas we had that we couldn't do yeah, or couldn't include in the larger game. Yeah, those just and go it here. kind it yeah it kind of like puts a bad it's a bad aftertaste to the rest of the game, right? Because mm. the rest of the game is a really good, for the most part, criticism of just like boomers. Mm -hmm. Like Harvester hates boomers like mm. in a big way. Um, and like all the legislators that were making these laws about how like, oh, disgusting and violent and horrendous video games are. Like they are, they were huge hypocrites because these are the people that were raised on these awful you know cowboy mm -hmm. shows yeah that just show the good guys killing those engines mm -hmm. and there, there's no consideration that these are human people like you know we're the colonizers like it has a lot to say about that mm -hmm. um and those are like really pretty valid points um but it's just that like the the whole rest of it is so um scattershot Mm -hmm. Like, it had too many ideas, and it didn't know how to present them all into a cohesive whole. Uh, it was simply biting off more than it could chew. Yeah. And I admire it for that, but it's just like, oh, man, I wish, like, I could more earnestly recommend yeah, Harvester, yeah. because it does have these parts where it's just like, well, not mm, that part, though. And, uh, yeah. Uh, mm, <laughs> you know. No, I hear you. Uh, it's a, it's a hmm. sloppy but good attempt at having a point. <laughs> right. <laughs> so, what rooms still have scritchy scratchies in them? I'm going to say zero. <laughs> no. the odd thing. They're, they're out there. They're out there. We'll find you. We'll, we'll find you, son of a bitches. It is Harvester, Whoa. perhaps, the catcher of the rye of video games? <laughs> <laughs> you know, that's not a terrible... Um, Oh, I haven't Comparison. Think I didn't this room at all. <laughs> did you go up into that area on the top there? Nah, I don't think I did. This room is okay. totally unfamiliar. You might have six Skulltolas in there. Who knows? The chest part. Yeah, the chest part. Like, yeah, oh, the, the chest part. Yeah. I feel funny. like the chest part was like... Okay, question. Was Seventh Guest out at the time of Harvester? Because I feel like it was riffing on how shitty that the Seventh Guest was. <laughs> because it was constant chest puzzles. <laughs> <laughs> that would that's be my, good, and then that would. That's theory. <laughs> you know, it's not bad either because that kind of does also then like uh, make it make sense like why the guy just throws like an axe in his head because then it's just like ah, you know, this puzzle. <laughs> yeah, like fuck thing. you. Yeah. I'm not doing this shitty, stupid chess puzzle. I'm not smart enough for this. Fuck you. Yeah, I feel I feel like Harvester has a lot of like the 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 puzzles for the most part are a lot less cerebral than your mist or your seventh guess style riddle type puzzles you know like those puzzles are really hard and yeah like, and you know point not. point and clicks are sometimes marred by this like not just the key ring solution problem where you're just rubbing your inventory against every surface you can think of but also like here's i don't know a chess puzzle mm -hmm. <laughs> you know well that was that yeah. guess was 93 oh my god i didn't think it was that late uh, that, that 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 early sorry I thought it was 95 or something. Either way, I think it's it's riffing on seventh guess for having like absolutely a shameful shitload of <laughs> really, really hard puzzles about chess. 
I feel like I have no idea what the chess thing is about. Yeah, no, I mean, I, I could definitely see, like, uh, yeah, like, mocking, like, seven guests are out of that. That that totally tracks, not, not that you've said it. Mm. But uh, I feel like sometimes, too, Harvester had a lot of, like, let's just throw shit at the wall and see what sticks, which, like, yeah, yeah. kind of sucks then. because it yeah, because then it like kind of befouls the whole. Because then you're like, well, did, were they making a point, or was this all just yeah. kind of random nonsense that happened to make a point? Kind of absolutely. Deal, you know? By the way, hey, mm -hmm. I want to mm -hmm. remind you that you have an item that can make you jump farther. You're right, I do. Yeah, you can make <laughs> that jump, buddy. Got it. Uh, was that before, or after the first Phantasmagoria? After because Phantasmagoria two came out in '96. So, therefore, the first one must have been before that. Um, but yeah, like, it really does poison its own well in really interesting ways because it will have really good salient points um, about how, you know, like, like it, it really, again, it hates boomers. It hates boomers so much. Um, especially, you know, one of the things that was brought up in the trials uh, for, you know, Mortal Kombat and stuff like that was like, wow, the video games are so violent toward women. Here's Night Trap. Are, isn't that disgusting that these women are getting killed? Uh, and it was very like, you know, we're, we're being, you know, f feminists and we're protecting women. And this is just disgusting that we have mm. like a slasher movie on a kid's toy because that's how, you know, games are thought of as children's toys. So it's like, right. this is a slasher movie on a children's toy. Mm -hmm. And there needs to be, you know, regulations, which, yeah, duh, of course, there should have been. But, right. you know, it's very, um, you know, to, to adopt a, a, a term I hate, virtue signaling, because Republicans don't give a fuck about women. Mm -hmm. <laughs> they do not give a fuck about women. Um, and they didn't back then. They don't they don't now either. But um Mm -hmm. Yeah, you know, all of their cowboy media was like, oh, damsels in distress, da-da-da. And, like, you know, all of their 1950s kitsch there bullshit, you there you go, you did it, nice. was completely, you know, disgusting toward women. Mm -hmm. You know, the perfect housewife, you know, all this sort of stuff. Like, the whole 1950s kitsch housewife that's the perfect homemaker and da-da-da. And, you know, you have to, you know, have children, make babies, be barefoot and pregnant in the kitchen. That was like the Republican ideal. So like, they're definitely ragging on that because all of the women in the town are played by the same woman, mm. uh, except for a couple of different cases uh, where they are uppity women. The, these are women that are that are you know against the status quo. There is you know the wasp woman is played by a different actress and Edna is played by a different actress. But pretty much all the other women except the older women are played by the same actress. It's like oh that's mother. You know, <laughs> mother is played by this actress and it's you know the same lady five times with different wigs on. Mm -hmm. You know, and it's like women are supposed to be this certain way. Oh. Oop, 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 oop. B. We got B. Yeah, I hear B. B o'clock. <laughs> Harvester did Nurse Joy first. <laughs> <laughs> no, absolutely. Yeah. I, um... Let me go yeah, so... It, 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 but at the same time, it's like... It's weird because it's making fun of boomers for wanting this ideal homemaker woman and how ridiculous that is and how oppressive that is and how unfair that is to women. Mm -hmm. And also, your your love interest is kept, you know, inside her room um, for the whole game and is useless. And she's like, I want to get out of here. I'm a living, breathing person. Oh, my God, this is scary. Mm -hmm. And it's because, like, she's playing the role of the daughter in the 1950s. Whatever the fuck is going on here. Mm -hmm. Nice. Good instinct. Glad you did it. <laughs> you can also roll into it as Baby Link. Um, I couldn't get a good angle, but yeah, no. Mm -hmm. I got you. Oh. I hear him. There he is, 30! We did it. Hey, my Good man! Stuff. We did it. Good stuff. My man. Good shit right there. There were six skulltellas in that room. Hallelujah. Indeed. Good stuff. But yeah, it's difficult because later on they have a, you know, a sexy lady that's so vain that if you tell her she's ugly, she destroys her face. It's just like... Oh, I forgot about that. Man, come on. What's, wow, he's scary even without... Die. <laughs> I'm oh, saved. Rich, if I gave me this mask. Hmm. 
Oh. Here, you get cursed. Mask of truth. It's the same mask Sheikah spoke of. Hear and understand the wisdom of gossip stones and the thoughts of animals. Hey! hey. I didn't think he'd be bald under there. Wait, before you go anywhere, mm -hmm. there's an animal in this room. You're right, actually. Right here. God, that's a freaking mask. I love it. I love this mask. Pick him up! Foolish. <laughs> A racing dog like me. Oh my god. Look at that! It's a clue for where to use the mask. What a That's good game. Awesome. They didn't have to put a dog in this room, but they did. Now, uh, I think normally I would be like, let's run over there, but I'm just gonna clue you on a text message. Two text messages I got, which is <laughs> what are you doing? And then Come, come to bed. Come to bed and bring me a water. <laughs> <laughs> Two valid text messages. Indeed. Throw back I right completely now. understand. <laughs> so let me deposit my rupees and, and No, I'm I'm very chuffed you got this spider house out the way. Mm-hmm. That's some good shit. You got a great mask out of it. You can talk to gossip stones all you dang want. Oh yeah, that's right, the stones. Submit yeah, the stones. Hey. They have hints and clues nice. about random things. Thank you, Digital Basic. 69 months. Nice. Indeed. 69 months? Digital Basic? Oh my god. What up? Indeed. I am going to deposit these 200 rupees and call them the Digital Basic rupees. Just for you, my friend. <laughs> oh? Oops, shoot. DBRs are the new NFTs. Deposit rupees. I am going to make a deposit. All right. So. And, oops. 200. Rich boy. There go. You're, You're a rich, rich little guy. guy. 821. Plenty of money it, for and the then, future. Speaking of the future, we must make the future happen and go rad rad. In the past. In the past. So. Listen, yeah, sorry folks. to keep you away from your loving and thirsty wife. That's oh. fine. <laughs> <laughs> nice. Uh. But mm. that's that's it for Majora Mondays. Thanks for watching. Hopefully we'll be back next Monday. I know we took a week off because of uh, just being flaky, honestly. Indeed. Not Indeed. gonna lie. We just no. weren't feeling it. That I week. needed a week <laughs> off my my normal schedule. So listen, yes. Yeah, I'm also folks. said that this this week is also a week off from the Silent Hill show I do with Jano Cho on Giant Bomb. So I'm like, eh, okay. He's very scared though. To be to be fair, he does need a break. <laughs> well, um, well, let me know if you're in the mood for extra Majora because I always like Majora. But that said, uh, yeah, I'll, awesome. Well, should we host over to? Let's go. You know what? Author Blues is playing tense. I like Author Blues. Ooh. Let's host over Author Blues. So. That's pretty good, yeah. Oh, thank you for Shadowhog saying uh, congrats on winning Giant Bomb Arcade Pit. Oh, nice. I, can I cannot believe my luck. I am so, <laughs> so chuffed about it. I don't <laughs> think anyone else knows how special it is to win the pit. <laughs> but I do, and it was very special to win the pit. I feel very blessed. <laughs> it's very, it's, it's, I'm very glad. For, what do you call it? So, uh, I saved the game, right? That counts. Right? Yeah, yeah, just, yeah. Okay, cool. Fine. Awesome. It's all, all right. right. <laughs> nice save stage, too, just in case. All right. Thanks, everybody. Have a good one. Please say hi to Author Blues for me. Later. Yeah. yeah. Bye. Bye. All right.